Okay, folks, Mitch and Tony here again with another DBA extravaganza. This is uh, another Karth Punic War theme thing, Second Punic War, and this is Hannibal on the March, the Road to Cani. <laughs> My mark. Hey, bear, I got shoes put, on. You got shoes on? Oh, wow. Oh my gosh. Maybe you'll win this time. Oh, my gosh. So this is a set of scenarios by uh, Connor Truby. So if they suck, it's his fault. <laughs> if they're great, it's his fault. Hey, just trying to be honest here. Way to go, Connor. So this to should be a total of four <laughs> four games. Uh -huh. And um, and they're all different scenarios if you've seen any of our other series. Um, if not, where you been? Check them out. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and... Uh, there's more stuff on there, more st more stuff to come. So as you can see, it's pretty snowy. Ooh. So this is the very first one. It's called the Alps. Oh. 218 BC. Imagine ready for your history lesson? I'm ready. Okay. Uh, in 220 BC, on the pretext of protecting a city in Spain, which Hannibal had sacked, Rome declared war on Carthage. Hostilities were slow to break out. However, as each faction mobilized, and however. As each faction mobilized and marched. No. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm just reading what's here. So I if thought you wanted sound If effects. it's miswritten, if it's if it's miswritten, then it's not on me. I make my own mistakes. I don't need any help. <laughs> By the way, all these scenarios are available on the DBA Facebook page, and I believe these scenarios are, are called Road to Cani. Uh -huh. So it's a PDF. Uh, it's free. It's in the file section on Facebook. Did you know there was files in, in the, on the Facebook page? Yeah, I see. So yeah. yeah. So, anyhow, so that's on there. Okay, in 218 BC, this is this is why I'm reading this because the names like this. In 218 BC, Consul Publius Cornelius Scipio, father to the man who would be Africanus, would take. Hey, we met him like yeah. a couple of weeks ago, right? Yeah, I remember yeah. that guy vaguely. Okay, uh, father to the man who would become Africanus would take around 25,000 men and march on Spain, which we fought. Ah. Consuls Tem. Consul Tiberius Sempronius Longus. Oh, sounds like what, somebody's well oh, endowed. Oh, the first Longus. Hub. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Starring in this one, Longus. Longus. Yeah. <laughs> and his partner, Griffiths. Uh, with around 30,000 men and 160 quincareems. You know what that is? Women from Hippo? No. <laughs> Couldn't get enough of that. That's a that is a trireme that is five decked. It's oh, a five decker. Whoa, man! Was to launch an invasion of Africa. So, consul to some this consul named Longus was going to launch an invasion of Africa. Hannibal, however, had possibly raised around fifty thousand infantry and nine thousand cavalry and began the long march to Italy. So, Hannibal from Spain, he decided we're going to take this battle to the Romans. But he's got to go over this little thing called the Alps. Yeah. The defining feature of Hannibal's long march was crossing the Alps. Mystery and debate surrounds exactly where the crossing took place. Regardless, the trek was riddled with vicious weather, treacherous terrain, and violent locals. Because not every Gaul that he, tribe that he ran into wanted to, you know, join his army and, huh. and fight the Romans. Suckers. Many did, uh -huh. and some were like, we're going to eat your ass first. Because, uh -huh. you know, you're marching through our land. Yeah. As they're, you know... Grabbing every berry off every tree, you know, on the way there. <laughs> the Alpine Crossing has enshrined Hannibal's name for thousands of years. However, there is a steep cost. Having lost perhaps 10,000 men before reaching the Alps through desertion and garrison needs, by the time Hannibal was in the Po Valley, his army numbered just 20,000 infantry and 6,000 cavalry. So he lost a good portion of his army, but... Yeah. On the way to the Alps, yeah. through the Alps, okay? Because the Po Valley's on the other side. Mm. We'll see the Po Valley in the next battle. Oh, Not in this one. Don't spoil it. Okay, battlefield. Two-foot square battlefield. A road is placed from the center of one board edge to the center of the opposite side. Here's where center marks, right here uh -huh. in the middle. Man, that road's sexy. Uh -huh. uh, pick one board edge connected to the road to be the Carthaginian board edge. The opposite is the Gallic board edge. The Gallic player then places four difficult hills, one in each table quarter. Each hill must not be within one base width of the road, another hill, or any battlefield edge. Well, we have a little drawing here, mm -hmm. so I'm just going to try to place it as as good as I can, okay? And this, the Carthage Union says, are over here. So the biggest hill is which one? This one? 
No, no, on here. Are they the same size? They're about the same size. So we'll take these two, put one there. Mm -hmm. Can't be within one of here. Mm -hmm. And another one here. Good, good, good. We're just playing the scenario. And then the other two go over here. We're just playing the scenario. Not trying to micromanage it and get a win out of it. They're right. about equal distance. Okay? There we go. Okay? Yep. The Gallic forces are Cavalry General, a Saloy, which by the way is called Gallic Youths or Skirmishers. Oh, they had a Hey, daddy, 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 daddy. <laughs> okay, oh, and then, then seven fast warband. That's what I have. We're going to put them off to this one. Your so, favorite. My favorite. But I'm wearing a Roman shirt, so I don't care if the Gauls die. Uh -huh. um, Carthaginian forces are Cap General. Uh -huh. That's Mr. Hannibal himself. Uh -huh. With two eyes, by the way. Two He's eyes got both right eyes right now. This is, like, this is good. He knows what's coming. Yeah. He can see it. He, has a, he can see it in stereoscopic vision. Uh -huh. Okay. And other cavalry. Yes. Two light horse. Yes. Three spearmen. Yes. That's the meat and potatoes of your force. Yes. A skirmisher. Yep. Two heffalumps. Yep. Which are really cold. Yep. And two solid auxilia. Actually, yep. it says auxilia. It doesn't say solid on here. But all of the scenarios, the scutari yeah, are, are been so, solid. Been solid. Yeah. So, anyhow, that's what yeah, they yeah. are. And yeah. a baggage element. Yeah, yeah, oh my yeah, gosh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't touch the little camel. Oh, wait. Wrong nope. baggage. Not that one. Okay. The baggage element in this scenario is mounted on a 40 by 40 square base and in all other aspects fights as solid auxilia. So that's oh. fights as solid auxilia. Wow. Though it may not move into contact with an enemy element using a tactical move. Okay. So it can't go in a corner, can't overlap anybody. Okay. Deployment and starting the battle. So I'm going to read this. You don't have to deploy yet. And then we'll do the special rules and victory conditions. Yep. Okay. So the Carthage deploys first. All elements must be placed in column on the road with the rear element in base contact with the battle Carthaginian battlefield edge. So you're placing on the road, yep. 12 deep. Mm -hmm. I assume you have 12 elements. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 13. 12, 13. 13 elements deep. Uh -huh. And the back one has to be touching that. Uh -huh. Okay. The Gallic army deploys second. The Gallic army may deploy anywhere on their half of the board. Except the elements must be more than four base widths from any Carthaginian element. So after you place, I have to be at least four away from you. Mm -hmm. Okay? Victory conditions. Standard victory conditions are not used in this battle. The Carthaginians must get both their general and their baggage element to safely, to safety. See special rules below. At, at any point, if either of these elements are removed as a casualty, the Gauls win. So Hannibal's got to get safe and, and the baggage the has to get safe you can lose the entire rest of the army but, not but just not those two what exactly is in the baggage that's more valuable than the rest of the army Hannibal's uh, clothes the girls from hippo yes hippo that's bitches thing. that's why it's a big cart is that what it is <laughs> about to have a flat tire <laughs> special rules Carthaginians are trying to get their general and baggage to safety. If at any time the Carthaginian general or baggage element finishes a tactical move and base contact with the Gallic battlefield edge, they're removed from play and considered to have reached safety. So they don't have to go on the road. Interesting. I figured they would have to go on the road. So you just have to get off this edge. So if you're if you're here, well, let's use the right guy. If you're here and you want to spend a pip to move him, as soon as he touches him, he picks up and he's he's considered a winner. You can't kill them then. Okay. Um, okay if at the both, end. Both got to get off. Yes. If at the end of the bound both elements have done this, then the Carthaginians have won the battle. Once they've reached safety, they may not return to the battle. While the Carthaginian general is not on the battlefield, all Carthaginian elements are considered out of command range. Mm hmm. So. So it really this, doesn't matter how many units are lost? Then? Correct. Just don't lose those Just two. Don't lose those okay. Two. At the start of each Gallic bound, before rolling for pips, if any Gallic infantry elements have been removed as a casualty, then a single Gallic infantry element may be returned to play and placed in the rear edge contact with either of the two flank board edges. So they keep coming back. They keep coming back. Wow. So before I roll pips, 
Okay. Any elements, any Gallic infantry elements have been removed as a casualty. Then a single Gallic infantry element may be re returned. Okay, so ideally, I only want to get one killed every turn because they'll always come back. Uh huh. If I get four killed, one of them come, only one of them comes back. Uh huh. Well, I'll get one back every turn. Yeah. So eventually, but it takes longer. And they come on these on these edges, the so two flank borders. Ones? Yes. Uh huh. Now, it doesn't say that I can't come in here mm -hmm. on this half. The other thing it doesn't say is if you kill four of my... Well, oh, my casualties don't matter either. Okay, there you have it. Definitely some different win conditions than a standard game. Very interesting, eh? Mm-hmm. Cool, right? I think so. This is that's what I'm trying it's to different. It's different. Very different. And we'll, so he moves as a solid ox too, right? Correct. Who goes first? That makes a big difference. Yeah, it is. Carthage goes first. So I have to put guys on the road or you can just multi-pip off the board. Ooh. If you roll the six, yeah. right? Yeah. Uh, uh. That's a mistake. Noob mistake. You don't put anybody on the road and then... That's a hell of a column. That's yeah. the world's biggest column. It's 13 elements. That's the winner right there. So, read off who you have and where. So we got people watching. Slow here. Elephant, elephant. Solid ox, solid ox. The more important cart. Solid spear, solid spear, solid spear. The general cab, Hannibal. Cab, light horse, light horse. Okay. I will deploy <laughs> on my half of the board at least four base what's away from any of your elements. So I've got to put somebody here. We'll just call him the Salor. Okay? And I wish I had more Saloy. Mm -hmm. My half of the board. So I can be out here. Uh-huh. And four away. And <laughs> the FLMs don't matter. They could just yeah. go, they could just hunt them down. Let's just put a variety of things. We'll put two over there. I don't we've never played this before. I just read it now, so when that whenever you guys decide to play this scenario, you'll have the hindsight of having seen what it about, played once. <clears throat> what about command? For you Correct. Guys? I need command too. Yeah. Just Wondering if you want to take that into consideration. <laughs> the good thing is you got a cab general moves fast. Cab general's always good. Hey, where's your stickum? Over here? Yeah. Okay. That may come in handy. Dice. <laughs> so fast warband, fast warband, fast warband, fast warband, fast warband, fast warband, cavalry, saloy, warband, fast warband. And let me just move everybody back a little bit, just so we're not right at four. We're a little bit over four. Make sure the same distance here. 
And you have the first round. Okay. See what happens. How about you? How about you? Glad it wasn't a one. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, well. Does, does all the rules apply like you get one free move mm -hmm. on the road? All that stuff so. applies? Yep. You can move for zero pips the first time. Max move, everybody. Which would be two. I'm going to try and do this. I got three pips that are that. So I'm going to try. The train be that that person that makes every pip ever so slightly. Every pip count. You like know, you do. You never know you're gonna you never know you're gonna run out. So for one pip No, this is the guy I want to measure on for. That's the guy. Okay. Starting over. Okay. <laughs> For one pip. He's going to go there. For second pip. Before I commit to that, does the whole column have to move or can I just pick out one element to move the maximum movement? Well, whenever you do it, Anybody, everybody that is part of that free move has to move their maximum distance. But he moves three, they move two. Okay. So he, he moves two? Right. Uh, yeah. Uh -huh. Or just do something else with them, and the column moves together. Yeah. That's, that's what I think that's what I'll end up doing. <laughs> Send the elephants bowling over here, well, and then push the column forward or something. Actually, what I'm thinking about is bowling this direction. So he'll go there. Okay. For one, because it's the first bound. Well, one, one, yeah. Mm -hmm. And this is three. Mm -hmm. That's the third one. And now, three. let me check one thing before we do that. Where's your rules? Because, of course, uh, I didn't bring them. Right there. By the time I stopped, didn't bring the rules. <clears throat> now my bookshelf went there. I want to make sure that you don't have to use that movement on the road first. Well, this is the stuff I'm paying for. Well, yeah, but... Oh, you mean like that would have to be the first move? Correct. And I don't think it ever mattered in the past, did it? We used it throughout the turn, wasn't it? You could do other things, but then when you come to the road movement... In each bound, the first move of every single element or column uses zero pips if it's entirely by road. Moves until a contact. Okay, so, so it can no, be whatever. The, it Just can the be first whenever. move. It can be whenever. All right. So this whole column <clears throat> gets a free move. What we have, yeah. see, this is what we've done with blind general is you can't do it after you've already realized you're out of pips. Yeah. Yeah. That's so that's why you want to do that first. Yeah. Because you you may not have rolled. You know, you may not have any left over. They don't get to move. So that's going to be it. 
That's going to be... That's going to be it. No combat. No shooters again. No shooters. All right. The Everybody, hairier ones. Everybody's up there now. One. Look at that. Oh, it's going to be the opposite way. It's going to be the opposite Hannibal's going to be a genius in the... He might be. <laughs> well, i got to start locking you down. <clears throat> That's what we're doing for one. Okay. First combat, we're going to go here. Uh -huh. uh, hold on a second. Let me think about this. I'm a five. You're a f I'm four to four, right? Yep. Let's not get him killed. So let's <laughs> do this one first. Four to four. Let's not get him get killed, him. huh? Oh, you should have went the other way. You would have killed the elephant then. It's okay. But you recoil me. Mm -hmm. I may kill him too. Maybe. Yeah. Uh, so it's three to two. Get him! Wow. Ooh. Roll low. Put it back! Lock. Right? So the difference and we two. won't go stay locked because nobody's solid or anything. Mm -hmm. Wow! What a cool start! It is a cool start. <laughs> now roll a one to make it really cool. Oh, no, no, no. no, no, no. Hey, these wins and losses don't count against us. No, no. So I want it to come down to the wire every time. Yeah. You can even win every one. Well, this well be, you should. You're Hannibal. This will be interesting, too, because... If I don't, if these guys aren't successful and start keep pushing forward, I got a roadblock sitting in front of me. <laughs> well, now imagine if this had happened and I had rolled enough to move these guys closer. Yeah, it's kind of a It'd different be, game. Yeah, you oh, know? Man. so this is okay. This is okay. Yeah, this is all right. All right, so I got a five. I want you to make it over the Alps. <clears throat> I, I want to push here. That's two. Mm -hmm. He's threatened, so he'll go there. Mm -hmm. That's three. Mm -hmm. And then we'll go... Can I give you some good news? What's that? If you push these guys forward, he's not going to recoil into them. They're just going to disappear. Right. Move forward, so it's right. actually not that risky. Yeah. I want to I, I keep my... Are you re ready for this? Well, he'll quick... You ready for this? If you push these guys forward... This is for people watching. Yeah, yeah. If you push these guys forward, now you've got a column, what, nine long? Yeah. Only if you fight three. this one and advance, the whole column will advance also. Oh, yeah. There's that, too. Pretty cool. There's that, too. Well, I'm going to bust off another guy. Not that I'm suggesting to do that. No, no, But no. it's a cool... It's, it's a cool brought The Solid Hawk's your favorite. Aha! Uh -huh. Will today be their day? I don't know. You don't like them because they're slow, right? Yeah. Other than that, they're fine? Yeah. So if they move, if they move two and a half, you'd like them more? Perhaps. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is what I'll do. I want to take a big chance. This guy's going to go here. I need to stay outside the I don't know about a big chance. It's not like it's your playing at the historical town for the Nick or something. Alright. So that's going to be number four. Five. Mm -hmm. and then for the free move. Pretty shy, right? Yeah, he's just gonna be shy. No, well, there's no fear of either one of those two elephants crushing him. Exactly. Unless I somehow switch well, that one. That, I mean, that one could get pushed. This guy just dies in place. So. That one get pushed, but they're beside him. He's not gonna run him over. Yeah. All right for combats. Oh, and happy Friday. Or as Mitch calls it, Wednesday. Yeah, this is my hump day. <laughs> All right, I'm going to start here with a five to two. Five to two on the Savoy. Get him. I want to try. This guy's still on Woo! This guy's still on fire. I rolled uh -huh. three fives, just so you know. I just want to get the overlap on the other people. Oh, we're <clears> upgrading <throat> to people. Yeah. Two to two. Two to two with a war band, which I can't kill you. No. Look, it's on fire. Wow. They stay locked. And a four to three. 
Look at this thing. Wow. Look at this thing. This is the Roost guy from, mm -hmm. from the other night. Yeah. Uh... Frame this joker. Okay, back to you. Well, it did roll a one for Pip, so. Yeah, it's, it's not too it's not too <laughs> bright and in, in command, but he loves a fight. <laughs> I could bring these two guys over, have it overlap on the, this guy. But I, the problem is I'm a two, and you'll be a four. But if I outscore you, you'll plow over this guy. Oh, yeah, and you can't yeah. win. Yeah. Yeah. How cool is that? There I mean, go. that's cool. It's cool. Is he within three? Because I'm... Oh, he's not within three. Mute point. Okay. Yeah. Did you move forward? Yeah, no. but I'm only moving like... Yeah, I, I can't do that. I can't do that. Yeah. Damn it. But that was cool. That was cool. Well, we're certainly going to move them up, so that's an option. How close can I get? I like talking about all that shit, oh, so yeah. people can be like, well, Hey, sure why didn't you do? I looked into it, and they just don't have the pips for as it. As soon as it's a, a column, the main thing is to box it in now. And I can move. So I was thinking forming a column with him, but I don't think this guy's going to be in the open. He is. But then I open myself up to the Hannibal coming over here and gang raping. Mm -hmm. And I say that like it's not a good thing. Because he's got two eyes. He sees what's coming. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to split the difference, right? The split the difference is I'm going to form a column with him. Okay, and then he'll come in. And then this guy will move by himself. Let's move to here. Let's do that. Okay. <clears throat> Let's do the elephant. He's double two, overlap. Two to three. Get him! Look Ooh, at that. Oh, he got him. Popped him. There's where all the elephant went. <laughs> this guy's on fire tonight. And then uh, three to two. Get him! Okay. Look. He runs. No, he flees. Yeah, but he'll stop. Beep. There. Dink. Okay. And I don't advance nope. against Sloy. Don't advance against Sloy. You know, it would be catastrophic if you roll the one right now. Oh I'm God. just saying. That'd I'm be just saying. Horrible. We don't want that. How about two? Actually, I, actually <laughs> to be honest with you, I don't want you to roll a one because I don't want it to be a battle that you got hosed because of really bad dice. Yeah. Now, if we were keeping score, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think. The two best <laughs> things to do. We gotta play this one again. Yeah, this, this is, is a, a cool one. This is. This, this is, is a cool. So be honest, what I would have done with your guys, I'd just try to push this way and just see what happens. Mm -hmm. Just to see what happens. Let's see. Well, it seems like a better... You know, if this if it wasn't this, I'd say turn the elephant and crunch into these right. guys. But, but what if you blow it? The yeah. game's over. I'm gonna do and that. I don't want the game to end that quick. I'm going to do one there. Crazy animals <laughs> coming up. Must I do everything myself? Well, if you want to win, you do. All right, that's the two stuff. Another thing, not so bad for him to be over here. Right. You can just draw it out this way. Oh, yeah. You know? Yeah, but he forgot his best clothing. Then. <laughs> it gives you some options. Yeah. The, the ladies. Yes. A hippo woman would be disappointed. Mm -hmm. All right, 
I wonder if Bill Melendez can make a hippo sound. He can do camel yeah, really well. So. He does good camels. Yeah, he does good camels. Scary good. 4-2. Oh, you didn't die. These guys are these guys are magic. And it's back to you. Big number, big number. Oh. Average. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I gotta see if it's an option. So that corner is gonna get to exactly. There. I think it's a, a bit of a stretch. Well, it's actually not that much of a stretch. We're gonna get him out of the way. Yep. No. Just shy. Just shy. Maybe three mil. Okay. And I could point that out. I was like, hey, that guy could have closed it back yeah. there. Sorry, folks. We have a better we have a better bird's eye view than you guys do. Yep. Hate to break it to you. Well, see, you're better off because if you kill this elephant, the casualty doesn't matter. Right. It's all about this. It's all about that. <clears throat> so, and you have a recoil now. Yeah, that's why I moved them out. Okay. Because I knew you would. Just <laughs> you have an entire them. corridor where I this know. guy can just zip down there. Yeah, that's why I was like, I think I better get out of it because I know you push forward him because that's the best way to kill him for you well here's the thing he's not threatening me because he's facing that way right yep so i could come in like this and lock these two down yep. by doing that yep so i have three yep this guy fights as a four uh -huh. he fights as a four i think we got to do this i think we have to do this. Uh huh. Okay. One I got one left. This guy fights as a solid auxiliary. Three. Huh? Yeah. A three. He's locked down. We gotta play this battle again. This is yeah, cool. This is really battle. cool. And I think just just throw the freaking hills, not finagle. Well, I'm over here to block the other thing. It's that just to follow the drawing. Uh huh. You know, this is like a clearing in the Alps. Well, I think if you were if you wanted to, seeing as you're pretty much there, and these guys are definitely going to be up closely to this half, you want to move. The hills is close to the center. That's true. You want these That's hills, true. You want these hills here. That's true. And then those hills somewhere back That's there. That's true. I just split the difference. That's yeah, what yeah, I'm yeah. drawing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now looking at, that's what you want to do. You want these hills up here close to center and those to make a effect over there somewhere. That's what I want. That's what you want. <laughs> you got one left. Yeah, I think we're going to do this and provide an overlap here yep. give you another minus one yep, yep. i mean there's all kinds it doesn't of... affect touching him does it? no because he's providing an overlap that's the only reason then he's allowed to do, do that okay gotcha yeah. all right so in the uk some people say that you can do that anyways without combat oh no that's not how we play yeah yeah so, so it's a four to two four to two get him he did boy you yes did, did Don leave his dice here? Maybe it's the elephants. So it could be the elephants. Yeah, I think it's Don's dice. Could be the elephants. Oh, no, it's not the elephants. <laughs> well, it's still a cool battle. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're still got game But here. remember, this is a battle that happened that's this way because you've rolled really poorly, too. Yes. So, unusually poor. I think what I have to do... So in case you recoil, well, eh, I don't want to take the chance. Yeah, you got to give yourself a recoil. You I have to. Get out you don't want to lose the game that way. Yeah, I got to get out of here. Now remember, your casualties don't matter, so that's your opportunity to be really creative. I need to get out here. It's a shame you didn't kill any of my guys. My guys come back on the board. Yours don't. <laughs> How far can I? 
So can I get to there? What's your measure from this? Well, okay. Yeah, you could do that that way. Yeah. Yeah, you could lock the back guy down. Yep. But more, Ever so slightly. More, more importantly, I think I get. I got to do a triple. Triple. You mean so, a double? No, this is gonna be triple. I'll explain afterwards. Is he got him still? Is yeah. That, yeah. Can I? That's it, right? Yep. So the other thing I'm thinking is, so you can't come in here to do this. Well, I guess you still could. Do. So either I'm trying to do it where I would threaten the whole area, so nobody can move on this section. So you should roll more than one. But maybe what I'm so what's do. more important, locking this guy down or blocking this, this area? Yeah, I think I'm going to have to do. I think you need to block the area. That, that's more important. So now we'll have to fight you first. Yeah, that's all I have to do. That's the move. And it's back to you. No combats. No combats. Hips ahoy. Yeah. That's a lot. That's a lot of pips. There's a lot going on. He's a three. If I go in a combat here, I'll be a one because he's providing an overlap. Unless I fight him first and push him off. But regardless, I realistically am looking at being a one. He fights as a solid ox, huh? Uh huh. I could pull him out of line, throw him in, in there, and push the warband in. And try to push him out, and then it's a four to a three. And if I if I win, no, you're an auxilia, right? Yeah. So I have to double. You have you. to double. Yeah, right. It's that's what it says. Yeah. So you're baggage that fights. We're fighters. We're not. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's better than just a, it's like a camp that gets taken. Yeah. It's not like a camp that gets taken. Now I see why you made it a solid ox. Yeah. Well, there's probably warriors in there. Yeah, yeah. Carrying shit, you know. Yeah. You shit carriers. <laughs> Okay, well that's important because that doesn't mean if it was like a if it was a camp ish uh -huh. and then all I have to do is outscore you and I take you, uh huh, then I'd be tempted to jump on you now. Right. It, it can wait. Right. Okay. So with that said This guy's a four. Mm-hmm. Fight one guy to the front. And I can either back him up or close the door here. Does the same thing. Yeah, he's quick kill, so it don't matter. Yeah, but I think I'd rather have the door closed because I'm closer to this guy where I have other options. Mm -hmm. So I think we're going to go one and we're going to go two. Uh -huh. As opposed to being behind yep, him. Yep, yep. Besides, you're in this guy's way, too. Oh, crap. This guy's, this guy's a, a misbehavior. It's okay. We're good. That's two. If you lose your leader, though, that's a bad thing, right? He doesn't come back, right? Or does he? I don't that's, think he comes back. I just thought about that. I don't one. think he comes back. He's probably the one guy you want to be a little careful of. <laughs> that's, yeah. Everybody yeah. else doesn't matter, but the yep. leader you probably want to. At the start of each Gallic bound, before rolling for pips, any Gallic infantry elements that have been... He's not infantry. Yeah. There you go. Mm-hmm. It looks like a simple thing, but there's a lot of ways to skin a cat. Yeah. Man, that made me hungry. Oh, a cat. Hello. Mm, what you cooking? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think we need to... That was two, right? Uh, yes. Let's do this for three. Three. Okay.
He can see him. Yep. And he can see him. Yep. So four. Yep. And these guys will form a column that's of ten leading. That's what I was thinking. I was like, all you gotta do is do that, then you can get them on. Well, I'm just trying to be as cheap about it as I can. That's the best way you know? to do it. And rather this guy be doubled here than doubled here. Yeah. It's a cool game, man. It this is. is a really cool game. Yeah. Oh, the pip dice is huge, that, though. That's huge. Okay. Well, we got some murdering to do, hopefully. Oh, this guy turns around. Oh, this is interesting because I could get this guy yeah. killed by. Oh, I want to do this one first. Because um, I'm a three to one. Three to one. And not flee you. I'm fleeing. You're fleeing. Okay, <laughs> that's good for you. Yeah. That's good for you because you 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 get out of the way because if you didn't flee, you'd block any of these guys. Guy, yeah, yeah, no, it's a good thing. And you don't you. advance either. I don't advance. I'm going to be there. Okay. That's cool. Uh, now what? Let's do the spear guy. Three to three. Three to three. On a tie, you would have, and he advances forward. Yep, he will advance there. It's 20, okay. Uh, let's do the, the four to your three. Four to three. Seven. Push you. Oh, interesting. Let's see if this war band's a goner. Three to two. I'm the two. Lock. But well, I'm you're solid, solid so you just reform me. That's uh -huh. it. There you go. Okay. Good. I got some. Yeah, one would have been really yeah, bad. Yeah, I would have been really bad. All right. So. Yeah, we don't want these pick walks. And then somebody will say, I don't see how the Carthaginians can win. <laughs> yeah. Let's do. One. Two, three, one, two, three, four, five. All right, this will be interesting. So turn around. Three gets him to. Remember, got to go diagonal. Probably. Probably halfway up on the cart. Mm -hmm. Well, if it does, it does. Yep. It's like exactly where it is. I know you're going to move forward. Yeah. Even if you don't go into combat, it'll give you some recoil yeah. room. Yeah, that changes a little Actually, bit. You probably don't want to go into combat. No, I don't want mm -hmm. to, yeah. Um, that way you get two recoils. That's one. Mm -hmm. Two. Mm -hmm. Oh, I gotta be careful. I can't do that. Well, that changes that idea. <laughs> I'm thinking about hitting this. Yeah, guy there's this a threat way. zone there. I forget about that mm -hmm. threat zone. So threat zone, baby. Yeah, keep looking at that. It's like it's a camp, but you do want to close the door on that element. There's no way they can wheel. No, I got nowhere to wheel. This butthole's in the way. Yeah. Yeah, you. <laughs> One, two, three. Oh, this is weird. You can fight him by sliding to his front, and it doesn't matter if this guy has a partial door closed on you because he quick kills you anyways. Yeah, I know. But what... Oh, it would be a four to three. Yeah. You can bring a buddy in to side support him. And then that would be five to three. I'm not so bad. It sounds crazy when you look at it, but the yeah. quick kill doesn't matter. And he's not going to give you a minus one. Yeah. 
Well, the other thing I was thinking about is pulling well, you them know, out. Use some of the cavalry to lock this shit well, down. Well, I was thinking about doing know? the old column and move this guy. Let's see, one, two, three, four. And eight. Yeah, I'd have to do the five. Or else that wouldn't allow me to do the column. But that's your alarm for your suppositories. Yeah. Well, we better do this before I forget it. This yeah. guy's got to come a out. A smidge. We're mm -hmm. going. Yeah, you got to do that. Just out. You got to do that. That was so sorry. That gives not you three you. So there's one, two, three. You don't want to lose the game like that. Two left. Two left. That's a cool scenario. Yes, very cool. Very cool scenario. So what happens... There's some interesting things you have to think about. What happens if I move this guy over here? Okay. He slides in there, like uh -huh. you say. Mm -hmm. But now that would give them enough room that I stay a column with these two, and they swung out, and they hit this guy. Would they pull him out? Which what? Which guy do you want to move? The this front guy. one? The back one? Yeah, this guy okay, goes so he up. comes in a little bit and yeah. slides over. Yep. So now... If that gives me enough room to do this. And I came in and... Oh, no. I can't do it. Again, the threat zone. Yeah. I'd have to be coming at an angle this way. Even then, I don't even think. So I think the next, the last pip, the best thing to do would be bring this guy over. Wait, before you do that? I mean, that's a good move. Yeah. That one's okay. What about this? You ready? Because of base what we said. You take him, and he makes contact here. Now, he has to come over if I as a minus one. And there is that. I mean, because it doesn't matter that you don't have somebody recalling. He's not going to recall you. Mm -hmm. He's going to kill you. See? This is the advantage of not keeping score. Yeah, we can both look at stuff and do yeah. that because it's cooler. It's just a thought. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. But that, go one, that was also that, good. Yeah, that was also good. That's very and, noble. But and it I moves like, him into a direction numbers. where he needs to be anyways. Yeah, he needs. To he can do that shit anyway. Yeah. Anywhere. Yeah. But this is a move that rarely anybody would do because, like, oh, it's kind of quick. It quick as a man. Yeah, it doesn't matter. And this guy's not providing anything because if he's like this. No. He gives a minus one. If he's like this, Just all he does quick is... Quick kills him, but it's sorry. Quick kills quick him, but quick kills him by that happen. anyways. Makes no difference. Exactly. Let's go... Is that the only... No, we have two combats. Just two combats. Let's go with my five to your two now. Correct. That's another reason why I do that. Ten to six, you'll fall back. I will fall back here. Four to two. Rolled good. You have. All week. Oh. <laughs> so good week? All week, yeah. And it's your turn. Okay. Hmm. Part of me wants to take these two guys and go, go finish them. I'd be a two and you'd be a three. Yeah. But that's all we're doing. Yeah. Likewise, I can... Um... That's the best option. But it, it, leave, it leaves me hanging myself yeah. out if it doesn't work. But the guys would come back. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, there's that. Yeah, I hadn't even thought about that. You're right. This pushing is okay. It's all right. Um, he's locked down. These guys can push together. This is a three. That would make it a two. I could bring another guy and bring him one. So it's two to one against the camp. Yeah. That's not bad. and doesn't leave these guys hang out to, hanging out to dry. There's that. But he can kill him because he's a solid auxiliary. Yeah. And two to ones can go to the I'd go with the harder hitting. But now think about it. This is a two to one. Yeah. But it's not killing you on an outscoring. I have to double you. Yeah. 
or a three to two, we're just outscoring. No, this I don't. I have, I have to. Double this is a two to three. Yeah. Uh, all I have to do is outscore you yeah, to kill yeah, you. Yeah. yeah. Here, if I do this maneuver right. here, you I'll be a two. Double. You'll be a one. Yeah. But I have to double you. Yeah. One or the other. Which would you? Which would you do, folks? Uh -huh. Call one nine hundred. <laughs> get a get a war band. <laughs> Lots of ways to skin a cat. Meow. If you get a girl from Hippo, she will just wait online. <laughs> He's locked down. He's locked down. They're locked down either way. Yeah. Let's go after Hannibal. That's what I think. I know that's what you would do, but you're a Harbach. Yeah. I am not yeah. a Harbach. This is more critical. I'm not because if it doesn't work, you bring you know yeah. he's going to get gang raped. It's going to get sooner or later. It's well, we'll find later. out what kind of a general he is, yeah, and it's the only combat. This, so two to is three. This, is this where he loses his eye, or or more <laughs> than his eye? Does he lose more than his eye? Look at that. Oh, yeah, I live. Wow, <laughs> unbelievable. It's Hannibal. You were scared. I was. I'm like, shit, six. I, I got to have at least a five. <laughs> It'd be awfully disappointing if you roll a one for Pips. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> It'd be so disappointing. Thank God I did it. <laughs> All right, five. That was great. That was. That's that was, why we play this game. Yeah. That's why we play. That's, that's why I've played this game for almost 20 years. This kind of stuff happens all the time. And you guys are able to see it. All right, we got to get things rolling, the fastest way to get things rolling. One. Mm -hmm. Imagine doing this with Blind General. Mm. Oh! <laughs> Does I think he's slightly behind him though. Mm. I think he is. He would have to move. This forward. guy is slightly closer to me than he is. Yeah. His his front is closer to me than his back. Is mm. that what you're trying to get yeah. at? Yeah, I yeah. think so. Yeah. A, a slightly. And here's the other thing. Is he okay? So I'm good. I could hit this guy from the rear then. Looks like it. Because I was worried that I wouldn't even be able to do that. Looks right. like it. So one, two. Let's see if we do this right. Should have enough movement to come out. Got three left, so it comes up. Well, he, he does that, and then he exactly. You did it right. Yep, that's exactly. You're making legal contact now. That'll get adjusted later. Yeah. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. I have two left. I think the thing is, is to come up here and support this guy. I think that's good. Let's stop. What do you have left? I only have one left. One left. Wait, I thought I was going to do that. No. Yeah. I'm going to set up. Before I move that guy, I'm going to stay out of. A smidge? Or should I? What would that be? It would be a two to one. You can't go into combat. Oh, that's right. I can't go into combat. No. You're right. Thank you. Not that badass. Okay, I'm not. I don't want to combat. Right. You're a smidge away. Okay. But now I should be, my butt should be. Yes. So that's my five. Oh, you One, want to prepare two. to hit him next yeah, time? Yeah, hopefully maybe okay. next time I can go in there maybe. Okay. We'll see. And these two are even with each other. Yep. Right? Okay. So this guy's going Everything to else would be uncivilized. He turns the face and he adjusts. So it actually could have adjusted so that he's like. Like in bad going or some shit like yeah, that. Yeah, it wouldn't matter. Well, it wouldn't. It could. It but. Would, yeah. If, yeah, if I didn't kill him and then he turns and he hits him. Okay, time for me to roll some more sixes. All right, let's. Uh, I believe I'm probably. Let's go my three to your one. Get him! Yeah. 
You said one. One. You roll like crap. I mean, it's the first time I rolled a one in combat, so. Hey. Okay, this is to, to be continued, okay? Four to two. Push me. I live. I live. And it's your turn. He comes back right away, right? Correct. So the rules is the start of each Gallic bound, before rolling for pips, any Gallic infantry elements have been removed as a casualties, then a single Gallic infantry element may be returned to play. So I can only get one every turn. Yeah. Okay? So we're going to put him and placed in rear edge contact with either of the two flank board edges. Oh, it has to be along here. But then the other thing you want to keep in mind, what about anywhere, right? Correct. I could put him here. be over here now, yeah. Right. But you want to be able to be commanded. Right. I want to be here. Yeah. Okay. Now we'll pips. Yeah. I think we could spare one to move him. Oh. I think. We need you. I think, yeah, I think. Interesting battle. Very interesting battle. It is a really interesting battle. You could play this one ten times and have a different thing every time. It's huge that they allow them to come back. That's good. Because the Carthaginians want to, they need to push on, but but they also got to come out of column to do it. <laughs> yeah. And so the key, I don't think I, uh, I think the elephants, I was hoping that they would push. You rolled more for pips. Yeah. You know, you did. Well, I mean, I think it was smart to put them up there. Because I wanted these guys in the rear because they're quick. Well, so let's they, look at the so let's look at get this. Up there and get if out. they had been in the rear, you'd still have them. Yeah, but would. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> saying. Two pips. I'm just saying. Cost two pips. Yeah, but they wouldn't be able to do what what I'm doing with these guys to flank people. One. Yep. Two. Uh huh. Three. Uh huh. And we're gonna move him for four. <laughs> no. Screw that nonsense. There. Four or three there. Um, push me. Dink. And three to two. Three to two. Six to four. Oh, really? They'll be even with them. No. I'm off ever so. Sure they will. They should be. Yeah, I guess they should be really. Three to two, two to two. Three to two. Push me. This dice on fire. On fire. And I don't advance. And two to one. Get him! Look at that. Damn, you got him. Dead. And that's the game. The dice is unstoppable. Wow. The die, you can't beat this die. This is a cool, cool scenario. So that's it. I like the scenario. Good scenario. It I is like a good it. scenario. I like it. It is a good scenario. It's almost good enough to make a custom map for it. Mm. Well, no, like I said. We need better looking troops, though. So when I paint both of these guys up. But <laughs> I would have, if I was. What, so I could beat your ass even better? This is what I mean. Because <laughs> now it's hard for me to get my cab out in here. It is. And then it might double make me think how I was going to... So if you put these all the way up against the edge, and then you put these one minimum, that looks like this. But the only bad thing is, you have to pay a pip for everything to move instead and of... And the bad you, thing is, is I have did. command and control. Yeah, thing. and you're going to have command and control problems. So... 
Ying and Yang. Okay. There you have it. Like it. So good scenario, right? I, I like that. You one. could play it ten times different. Oh, and easily. Would you want to play the Carthaginians all ten times? Oh sure. Really? Yeah. Well, okay. There's all kinds of there's a lot just by on. how you set up your force yeah. alone. Yeah. Makes a huge difference. You know. I think leading mm -hmm. with the elephants is probably the way to go. Yeah, because I was hoping with their high numbers they would bowl forward through push, keep pushing. You know, because once they get a hold of something, they're going to keep going. They're going to keep following. So I don't even. You want you want bowling with the elephants? And Unfortunately, they, they, you threw a gutter and ball. And they guttered all. <laughs> they all guttered. Okay. Yeah. All right. That's battle number one. Hope you enjoy that. Like and it's exactly an hour. Woo! Yeah. Number two. See you in a little bit. Okay. Battle number two. Battle of the Trebia. 218 BC. So Hannibal's crossing of the Alps set Rome into a panic. Well, you know, in the real world. Yeah. <laughs> well, he, he did take some casualties, but he pushed through. But so. he, he, he lost his clothing. <laughs> hey, you, your fantasy can be whatever you yeah. want it to be. I don't judge. <laughs> well, he's just still got two good eyes. Ha For now, yes. <laughs> Hannibal crossing the Alps sent Rome into a panic. Scipio left his brother Gnaeus in charge of the army sent to Iberia and returned to northern Italy. Sempronius Longus ordered his men Very who nice. were preparing. You like him, huh? <laughs> yeah, him and Biggest Dickus. <laughs> Sempronius Longus ordered his men who were preparing t for their African invasion in Sicily to disband and make their own way back to Italy. It, the time it took Rome to raise new forces, however, was needed by Hannibal to rest his exhausted men and make sure he had firm control of the Po Valley, including the massacre of the adversarial Taurini tribe. They'll teach him. Yeah, I guess they, they got all uppity and you had to they got put them in their place. Taurini. Taurini. Sounds like a bunch of bullshit right there. <laughs> Taurini. <laughs> After mustering new forces, Scipio initially began to engage Hannibal alone. But initial skirmishes were Carthaginian victories and Scipio was even wounded himself. Scipio was forced to fall back behind the river Trebia where he met Longus and his fresh soldiers. Thank goodness. Mm -hmm. Hannibal's forces themselves have been inflated with Gallic troops, so numbers at both sides at this point are said to be about 40,000. There was allegedly disagreements between the two commanders, with Longus eager for battle and Scipio more cautious. Hannibal and his younger brother Mago hide forces in nearby cover and sent his lighter forces to harass the Romans. This skirmishing successfully drew the eager Longus across the river and into an amb the ambush in December 218 BC. Two by two battlefield, select one board edge to be the Roman edge, that's this one, and the opposite one to be the baby killer edge, I mean the Carthaginians. Refresh Place a river so it connects both flank board edges and is around three base widths from the center line, splitting each player's half of the board. There's also a little drawing here. Oh, no. You're doing all right? No. Is this one right? Yeah, it runs that way, yeah. Yeah. Yep, we'll just put it right in the middle. Oh, you were thinking it ran that way? Correct. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, I'm, I'm, I know how the real battle played out. I'm like wondering, how's this going to play out? Okay. I have not read ahead, so I have no idea what we have here. Um... Along the center of the board and connecting the Roman and Carthaginian battlefields, place okay. Along the center of the board and connecting the Roman and Carthaginian battlefield edges. Hold on a second. Oh, the this is the road. Oh, there is a road. Yeah, there is a road. Road back in. Yeah, and it's how I thought. Okay, so here's the center line. These deployments are just like Phil Barker wrote them. Doesn't make any sense sometimes. Okay. Here's the road. Hey, it's late. Um, center is here, right? Oh, so yeah. three back, the river comes across. Oh, gotcha. Let's put the road over the river. Mind the gap? Mind the gap. Okay. Okay. Roy! Right. It, so you could barely make out the river. Oh, yeah. Okay. So 
back to the major not how much ink you used. Um I put it in color, but Ooh. it wasn't printed at home. Uh mm. River Road. The Carthaginian then places a marsh on the side of the river closest to their own board edge. The marsh should be placed so it's within one base of both the river and the flank board edge. The Carthaginian player should place a gentle hill between... Well, where the heck is the gentle hill? Oh, there it is. I'll get you one. I'll get you a good looking one. You want the big one, right? Yeah. This one. So I could thing. do the either on either side the marsh. Doesn't matter. So you like this? No, we did it wrong. The river's here. Yeah, because I deploy and I move. Okay. Yeah, because historically, these guys ended up going through the river and were freaking wet, and it was cold, and it did, they didn't do really well with that. They're kind of like you with this breezy weather. See? Yeah. Frozen the whole time. Crazy. The name for that is called Sissy. <laughs> okay? And then the marsh is over in here. you got to be within one base width here and one base width of the river. Within. Well, then that makes it... Okay. okay. The marsh should be placed within one base width of both the river and the flank board edges. Uh -huh. Oh, so they could be even closer. Or at one. I'll go closer. Right. Then the Carthaginian player should place a gentle hill within one base width of their own board edge and the flank board edge, which is the furthest from the marsh. So over there. Mm -hmm. Gotta be you gotta be within one and one of these two. Within. Okay. Okay. You're within one there. Okay. The forces. Carthaginians. Cavalry general. Yes. Three spearmen. Yes. Three solid warband. Yes. Four. four. I'm sorry, four. four yeah. Drink. Two heffalumps. Yes. A cavalry. Yes. A light horse. Yes. A solid auxilia. Yes. And a saloy. Yes. yes. And a camp. Dun, dun, dun. And I have two forces. I'm not going to bring them on the board just to show you, but basically, both forces are the same. They have a calf. Notice it. Oh, this guy's the general. Okay. So they have a cavalry general, two blades, a solid ox, a spear, and a saloy. And the other one is a calf. It doesn't say he's the general. Uh -huh. Two solid blades, and that's... a solid ox, a solid spear, and a saloy. Yeah, and this is longest. Scipio. Oh. That's not the general. And, and the one that is the general is longest, according to Oh, this. Scipio was under longest? I think what, what it was is that normally the Romans would alternate what day they would command. Ah, if this it was is the two, odd day. So it was the day the longest commands. Longest was odd. That's right. Scipio was okay. even. Deployment and starting the battle. The Carthaginian player deploys first using the standard deployment rules. However, they may place their Saloy element in rear edge contact with the flank board edge closest to the marsh. So they can, they can, you set up normally, but he can set up, okay? Uh -huh. The Saloy must be on the Carthaginian side of the river. Uh -huh. May place. May. So it doesn't mean you have to place them back there. Okay? The Romans then deploy all their forces. Longus, this guy, must deploy his forces on the Carthaginian side of the river, entirely on the side of the road closest to the marsh. So I have to set up here. Hmm. Oh, that is wacky. That's cool. Longus must deploy his forces on the Carthaginian side of the river, entirely on the side of the road, closest to the marsh. 
All elements and longest force must be more than four base widths from the flank board edge and no closer to the Carthaginian board edge than the center line. Who sets up first? You set up entirely force. Then Scipio, the other half, must deploy on the Roman side of the river and the opposite side of the road to Longus. So Longus is going to be here. Yeah. Scipio is going to be now. over here on this side of the road. Okay? There is no limit on how close to the flank board edge of Scipio's forces. Carthaginians take the first bound. Victory conditions is standard victory conditions. Four? Yes. Special rules. Despite the Roman forces being listed as two separate armies, they function as the same force once deployment is complete. That's it. Aha! Dun, dun, dun. So north is that way. You come from the you're north. Calling me. Actually, north is that way. You're calling me. You no, know, in real life, it's north. Yeah, you're a Yankee. <laughs> and north is that way. Uh huh. In real life, the way your building is oriented. You have an oriented building as opposed to an Asian one. Oh, what? I mean, you don't have to place them over there. Yeah, I thought about it. Now I'm kind of looking at how it is. I'm thinking, uh eh. Got to place your camp for... Well, you don't have to. You're setting up your whole force. I don't have a camp. Okay. Right? You can going to pull one out. I do have a camp. So you have to set up your camp first. Then I set up mine. Not that it really matters. It's part of Scipio's, and I'm putting them over here on this side of the, of the road. And there's going to be forces in front of it defending it. If you don't want your cap taken, put people in front of it. Yeah. You don't have to put people inside. you got to put people in front. What an idea. Yeah. Some people don't get it. Ooh, the question is, though, are, are the war band going to perform in this battle? There's an awful lot of them. And I have a feeling they're going to be really close to the action. I think this is going to be another cool game. I think so. It's looking that way. I just the alternate setup is a big is a big win for me. Where's the future uh, Cyclops going to go? Uh huh. <laughs> You want to put your warband four deep? Yeah. Well, if they're fighting knights, it won't matter. There is a... Seven, yep, okay. And we left the slowy board. It doesn't say on here, but this was a snowy day. Stay away from my animal. Hmm. That's the smell of big manure. Yes. Okay. I too ride elephants. <laughs> so again, just to recap. Longus must deploy his forces on the Carthaginian side of the river. Yep. Entirely on the side of the road, closer to the marsh. All elements and longest force must be more than four base widths from the flank board edge. More than four from the flank That's board it. edge. Okay. That's four. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. And no closer to the Carthaginian board edge than the center line. That's that. So you can't be here. You have to be. So you're going to be like a box right here. More than four base widths from the flank board edge and no closer to the Carthaginian board edge, which is what? That one? That one. 
than the center line. That's the center line. Okay, so the center line's here. Yeah. So I can't be. Well, here. No, but I can be. No, you gotta be in here. This this square right here. What's the distance from? Because you said you can't be. Closer. No closer to the Carthaginian board edge than the center line. So the center line is here. Yes. So you can't be closer. Here. You can be there and not here. Why am I having such a hard time reading this? <laughs> no, I just I want to know what the perimeters are. This is the center line. Okay. You can't be over here. So I can't you have to be, be in here. No closer to Carthaginian. Than the center line. I have to be closer to the center line than the Carthaginian board edge. So I could set up my guys. Here's the center line. Yeah. I could set up my guys here if I wanted to. I'm not going to, but I could. Right? Because what's the distance here? Uh, okay. Distance? You see, I mean, I could set up like this. I don't think that's what was intended. No. And it's also stupid suicidal. Okay? So... You have to you, be closer to there. Though. You have to be closer to this than I am to that. Uh, well, I'm certainly closer to that. I could. I could. You don't. You don't. I thought. Say the center line part again. All elements in Longus's force must be more than four base widths from the flank board edge. Okay, so they right. can't be in this piece of paper. Right. Okay, and no closer to the Carthaginian board edge than the center line. See, this is. I don't think you can be on this side. You have to be on this side. Well, I'm not going to be on that side. Right. But for correction purposes. Uh, I think you got to be in the square here. Well, I have to be on this side of the river. Yes. And you can't be no closer. But according to what this is written, I can write, I can set up there. No, I think he's saying you're going to be here. Because that you can't be c closer. You, you can't be any closer to the car to this edge than the center line this is must be center. more than four base widths from the front board edge and no closer to the Carthaginian border edge than the center line then the center oh. line then well center see line. i would have written that differently see you gotta be I behind been different that. i'm not gonna go past the center line this is your area i'm not gonna go past the center line because it's stupid but, okay right well this is i'm just doing the box Right, I'm inside be, there. You have to be in there. It should say, but you can't go past the center line yeah. of the board yeah. that way. He's, he's okay. Following. No closer to the cards you board than the center. Barclay. Oh, I see. Well, you got to read it three times to see. Yeah, okay, Barkery is here. So that's your that's your yeah. that's your deployment zone right there. I, I can barely make out what this setup area is. Yeah, it looks like it's inside the thing. Yeah. I should have put it in color, but it didn't work that way. Aha! Uh -huh. We needed to be here. I, I wasn't going to go all the way in there. So, but that's, anyways. So everybody knows that's where they got to be. All right. And so then those guys got to be in here. No, that's these guys. Yeah, the other guys. Yeah. The, the people that aren't longest. <laughs> the ones that aren't the longest. That's right. The shortest. The shortest ones are over there. The longest ones we're able to go through. And notice it says nothing about the river, so you can roll for a river. You don't know what the river is. Okay. In real life, the river was frozen. So maybe you just treat it like regular ground. It doesn't say that, so we got to roll for the river. Mm -hmm. right. right? I mean, that's yeah. play the rules as written. Yeah. I would have made... I, actually, there was a problem with the rivers. Like, some things fell through the river. Make little special rules of crossing the river. Huh? Yeah. So this is... Hey, like I said, I, I haven't read this before. This is... All brand new. We're going to put him over here. We're going to put the Saloy here. And we're going to put Longus here. Longus Maximus. Longus to the max. Okay? Yep. And then the other little box. Scipio's forces must deploy on the Roman side of the river and the opposite side of the river, the longest. All right. Okay. 
You don't have to have a camp, do you? I do. Oh, you do have it to have a camp. It does say camp. Okay. Yep. What's, it doesn't matter about being how far from the road? There's no limit how close to the flank board edges for skipping okay. his horses. So he can deploy. Well, right? I, I can't He's deploy here. It's just a standard no, deployment. No, he can deploy his standard deployment then. But it has to be on this side of the road. Okay. Did you go over who's where? Uh, I shall. Saloy, solid ox, four solid warband, three solid spear, cab general, elephant, elephant, cab, and light horse. Okay, we're going to use a Roman numeral. Ooh. So, you're in luck. I don't have to use this anymore. All right, I've got this one. <laughs> <laughs> you may. I thought it was on fire. There's the whole point. I wore the, the shirt and the and the, and the Roman dye. Uh -huh. um, who goes first? The Carthage. Okay. Uh -huh. oh. Hold on a second. Solid ox. Yep. Solid blade. Solid blade. Spear. Saloy. Cavalry general. Solid blade. Solid blade. Cavalry. Spear. Auxilia. Solid auxilia. Saloy. All right, here is one. I'll, I'll call out the Roman numerals. Nine, nine. <laughs> IV, IV. So this is one. That's one. This, this is, is two. two. Still two. Still two. Still two. That's two. I think you scoot it over a little bit. Okay. I don't know. It's a big fan. Yeah, you too. No, I'm going to hit that so I can't. Oh, so just move the other guys back so you can move the group. Well, what I'll do is this. Watch. This. Will be three. So this is one, two. And this will be three. Okay. You're not going to be a group? They'll be a group. Like, they'll be their own group. Gotcha. So this guy's ever so slightly behind them. Yeah. Okay. But touch it. You're already giving yourself a handicap. Okay. Okay. No shooting. No shooting again. Here we go. I. I. And oh. I am Caesar. <laughs> I am the longest. <laughs> yeah, that's a problem. That is a problem. Let's look at a couple things. First thing I'm going to look at, you got a 15? Yeah, yeah. Let's put a 15 here and see if I contact you if I'd be in bad going. I'm not. But I'd only be able to move these two blades in. We're not going to do that. That is right out. Right out. So the problem is with crossing this river, if I could move this whole force and attempt to cross it, but it ends up being a river that only one unit can go across, yeah. you have to stop there. Yep. So I blew the move. So with all of those things, I think I'm going to move him. Don't you want to know what the river is? Not when I roll in. Not when I roll a one. Too valuable. Locking him down. Okay. Send the send the triarii out there. Uh huh. Or, yeah. Let's do that. That's more orderly. Let's do that. You're going out there. Okay. Yeah. I like, I that like makes more sense. I mean, yeah, well, it depends. 
To me, it depends. To say me, I'd want to know what the river is so I know how fast I can get over there. No, if I rolled a two, I'd do it, but what if I can't? Yeah. You know? Hey! Meanwhile, hey. you're on crack. We have two eyes. It's and because we I switched everything. dice. Yeah. You're even rolling better because I switched dice. See? Is that the same dice you used in the first yeah, game? Yeah, same dice. I've switched dice, and, you know. Playing the rollings now. Well. Well. Gonna go in? Yeah. Better doesn't, fight. Might as well fight me before these guys get across the river. Doesn't matter about being as a group because I won't get support there. Right. You got the pips to move everybody up. I mean, that's going to cost one, two, three, four. Yeah, that's what we'll do. So he's going to. He'll end up being here. Mm -hmm. He'll end up being there. Right. Uh, wait, before I do that, I think I'm going to spend two to do this. Okay. Then everybody's coming up. Mm hmm. Careful, those are needles. I see. I feel. They're dulled, though. He's not going. I don't blame you. One, two, two three. three. No, this is still one. Still one. Still one. Now. Now you're up to that's three. three. Three left. So, Warband, even though they're solid, they can still move through bad going at the speed of two. Yep. They're light on their feet. That's four. I think he's going to go with. Okay, still four. Five. Mm hmm And six. It's like a rolling ambush. I guess. Something like that. Where are you starting? Here? Uh yeah, let's do my five. So I'm a four. That brings me up to a five. Yep. That brings me down to a four. Yep. And you're a five. Yep. So you're five, five my four. four. Come on! That's a four. That's a Not six. Not good enough. Okay. Nobody advances forward nope. because he's just a yep. he's just a helper. Just checking okay. it out. Sure, I died. Okay. All right. Let's um, let's go my three to your two. Yep. Four. Ah. Oh, oh Warbander win winners again. Pushed back. Okay. Ooh. I'm going to go with my three now yeah. to your five. Well, it's a three up to a four, yep. down to a three to my five. Yep. Three, three five. to five. Again! Six. I recoiled live. you. I live. So you recoil, and, you, and, you and I on. come forward. That's right. Because we're cold and. Longest says forward. <laughs> so that makes this a four to four. Uh, yep. And I rolled a four. So you recalled me by a little bit. It's your turn. Now, we know where he is. I think he's locked down. Oh, but he's locked down from the elephant, too. Oh, well, this is interesting. Hopefully, I'll roll another one. It's not going to be a very fun game. You shouldn't. I agree. I shouldn't roll a one. No lies. A V. V for victory. That's right. Five. Okay. All right. So he's locked down by him and him. Yep. So if I go into combat with the elephant. The, don't forget the door is probably closed. Should we dress that up? Yeah, no, the door's closed. I have to go to yeah. a door closed situation. Yep. Now. Let's look at the river options here. Yeah. If I roll for the river, if it's the worst river. You just go over and calm, you move one. Mm 
Man, but, that, but, that's a tough. That's well, a tough here's the deal, call. though. If you if you only can move one, at okay, least so you'll lock that let's, out. Let's look at the numbers. Look, doing that. Well, let's look <laughs> at the numbers first of all. If I roll for the river and it's a one or two, you, you move. it's it's not there. It yeah. is there for fleeing purpose, but yeah. it doesn't exist. Yeah. Okay. If I roll a three or four, I can still group move across it, but I'm going to be able to move a speed of one. So that's okay. Yeah. The problem is if I roll a five or six. That's bad. If I roll a five or six and I decided to move like this line, the entire line is going to stop there. Yeah. Am I close enough to lock you down? I'm not. Why not I move... Uh... With a five, you, unless you need a lot of pips to do other things, why not just move one guy to test the water? Yeah, except I don't want to move this guy up. I think it's too risky. He cannot be quick killed in the water, right? I mean, even if this guy were to hit him, he can't quick Correct, kill. Correct, because it's not open ground. Yeah. So. It's not open ground. It's. So there is. It's that. something else, even if the creek is there. Yep. But then I don't want to have to commit to. Let's test the water. Just with this alloy. That's what I do. Just with this alloy. Okay. Okay. It's not even. Okay. Really and then he's going to stop there. Yeah. Okay. The rest of the force. You're going to stop with your front still in the water. Yeah, yeah there you go. There you go. Well, yeah, I'm still in it either way. But you don't want to have your front out. And then I hit you, and I'm a plus one. You want to keep your front in the water. Trust me. Uh, you won't be a plus one, because the bank won't count. That always counts. It's no, like, it doesn't. Like if no, there, it doesn't. That should be. A, no, it doesn't. It doesn't. If it not on a not on a one or two. Oh, it's like I'm, it's nothing I'm still gonna be. I'll still be here. Okay. Okay. All right. Um. And I have to keep it the then same. you got a five. So you got, five. Yeah. you got four left. Yeah. four Let's not pull a dawn and count those things down. That was. Yeah. That's. But you can group move. If I move these guys straight forward, who are they going to line up on? No, I have to line up to you because I'm on Correct. There. But which way are you going to slide? You're going to go this way. I think so, yeah. Recoil is going to pave some of your guys. No, -uh. there's no running start. He should be up against. Him. Oh, you're right. Only he dies. No, that only matters if you're encountering another elephant. No, he if he can't get a running start, he dies. If you hit another elephant. No, they have to. For them to kill other dudes. No, they can. They, be something no, like a, no, not with that. Not with that. I'll read it. Okay? I'll read it because that's important. Mm -hmm. Because what, you, what you're describing here, we never have happen. Because we don't have situations like this. Well, usually nobody's behind the elephant. Yeah, that's stupid. But you really because, don't have much of a choice. it's still the same premise where he has to get a running. No, but it's... it's be Well, let me just read it. Okay? Let me just read it. Recoiling or being pushed back. If the recalling element is elephants, all friends or enemy met that are not in BUA or camp or destroyed. Elephants yeah. recoiling from close combat against the defenders of the city destroyed. If two elephants meet, both are destroyed. Surviving right. elephants finish a recoil. If the recoil element is not elements, okay. Push back a recoiling or pushback element whose rear edge or rear corner meets terrain it cannot enter. A battlefield edge. Friends it cannot pass through or push back enemy or a city for a camp ends it move there an element already in such contact with any of these cannot recoil and is destroyed instead okay now let me look somewhere else okay i think it's on the elephants well there is no elephants oh that would make too much sense <laughs> Let me read that again. I'm thinking you're right. Just 
Yeah, but I want to get a, it right. We have to have a running start. Okay. If they're touching it's somebody, because, already, they it's, die. it's that last sentence. If they're says, touching somebody, they die. If they're not touching somebody and they hit anybody, they all die. An element already in such contact, which you would be. Right. Okay, if I hit you. Yep. Okay. With any of these, cannot recoil and is destroyed instead. So you're not able to start your recoil. Right. So he dies. Now let me read under the elephants. I bet lots of people don't play it that way. I remember we. I agree with you. No, yeah, but it wasn't this situation. It was two elephants, and it was a, it was at ninety degrees. It's a ninety degree situation. So it's a situation like this. You get hit and you recoil this way. If if there's a smidge of a space there, he he's, he's going to get and paved, else, and he's going to yeah. keep going. And anybody else, yeah. right? Yeah. But because here it dies, and that's that's that how we've dies. always looked it up because of that situation. Uh -huh. We've never looked it up that he's up against the guy and is a recoil. Mm. So we may have even gotten it wrong. <laughs> Doesn't say anything there. I'm agreeing with you. I'm agreeing with you. You yeah. have to get a running start. Yeah. You have to get a running start with the elephant or the ele only elephant dies. And that's fair because there's times where the elephant just ran off the field. Yeah. You know? Yep. Yeah. Uh, it's not like they always stay around. Yeah. I'm waiting for peanuts. <laughs> so is there a way to capitalize on that bullshit? What if I move as a column of these guys? They come in, and then they come in, and as soon as the first guy is over, I can start maneuvering, right? Yeah. The so front, then I go like this. the front of his base. So I go like this. And I go boom. Because this is a friendly game. Let's see where that where that does to you. Uh-huh. This corner should still be touching here, right? Yeah, I think there's not going to be any way to get around you, it. You'll be able to kill him every time. Yeah. I, I don't think there's a way to get around it. You just, only he's going to die. Yeah. Okay. Okay, that, that's good to know. That's that's good to know. And likewise, if I hit him from this way, I don't think I could. And he recalls this way, you won't kill him because he just he right. by the bare minimum. Yeah, stop. Right, okay, right next I, I think we got all that ironed out. Yep. Okay, maybe some people learn something, <laughs> but. Um, and that may not be what Phil intended, but that's what his rules say. Uh -huh. Is that? Um, you're a five versus foot. If I push these guys forward, and you conform to me, you have four to three. Well, Listen. he doesn't. He doesn't turn yet. No, but okay. he he's, he's still here. Yeah, yeah he's, he's going to slide immediately. Yeah. Well, here's messed up. Hold on a second here. Hold on. He's here. Yes. I could move just these two, and you'll slide this way now. Yes. Yep. And you can get it down to a three to three. Is there an three. advantage to that? Oh, I can get well, it down to a three to three. You get it over there, and now you can get it three to three. Well, without moving him over. Yeah. Because you said, or wait, was he threatened or not? Yeah, he is. I guess oh, I can't do it. So I you got to do it that I way. I need to do this. Yeah, and he slides go. over. Yeah. Okay. Now I'll bring that guy. Now this guy comes up. Yeah. Okay. We've used up One, two, two three. We're, oh, yes. Three. Two more. Two left. It's very interesting. Isn't it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's cool. Yeah. But we're fighting in quarters that we're fighting in messes that we wouldn't have gotten ourselves right, into. Right, exactly. Yeah, which it can makes, happen, but which makes it better. Yeah, it makes it better. You would have never done that if you, you know. Right. Now he's not locked down. No, I thought he was not locked down by that. Ah, uh, okay. Right. He was locked down by both, uh, so now he can't go that way. Yeah. 
which I wasn't going to anyways. One left. One left. I think this is another one you can play a bunch of times. Uh huh. It's looking that way. Score one or two indicates a reverse paltry, too shallow, and easily banked in defense and can be passed through as if in good going. Yes, but you still have to enter at the same angle of yeah, the river. Yeah. So I can't just slide move down the river like again. this. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. It just I can move my full speed through it. Right. There's a difference. Which I kinda like that he did that because if you think about it, a whole yeah, lot, yeah. a bunch of guys are gonna Hey, let's use there's the a river dog. Well, there's a tripping hazard there. Yeah. There's, a, there's some really? kind of a tripping hazard, yeah. you know. It's difficult to move a thousand guys down the river, a, a creek or anything. A creek? A creek. Yes. A creek. Let's go down this way. Don't you know? It's nature's path. <laughs> okay, I can cross backwards, though. Yes, straight back. Boom. You can do that. Was he locked down? Mm, I don't think he was because they pushed forward here. Okay. So when I come here, I can go over and do funny, funny dances if I needed to. I don't need to. I'm good like that. Let's not lose the game by him getting killed. Oh. Let's let's find a different way to lose the game. Longest. Okay. He turns the face. I bet everybody does this differently. Yeah. But we've never had this situation. No. I agree. He he doesn't have a running start. Right. He's already met a guy. Yeah. So. So he he dies if he loses. Let's do that one first. Three three. Get him. Four. But four solid. solid pops him. Yep. And yeah. I don't advance because I'm fighting now. Yeah, you gotta be. Okay. Funny. I bet everybody did that differently. Yeah. Hey, Very that's, interesting. That's what the rules say. Um. Two left. What is this one? I'm I'm down to like a three there. I'm double overlapped. Yeah. So I'm a three. If I win this one, I improve this to a four. Yeah. So let's do this one first. Four to four. Four to four. Get him. Six. Killed him. Dead. Wow. Longus. Yeah. Wow. All the way in. Wow. Now it's a. Three to four. Hey, maybe this is a sign. Maybe from now on, oh. I'm just going to roll good from now on. <laughs> three. Crap, that means my painting's going to go to shit. Oh. <laughs> this one. Get him! Yeah! Another one! Well, I mean, I, I don't um, kill him, but I yeah. won the combat. That's a... Yeah. That's I'm a, a ten. Okay, and I'm a six. So I go to there. The guy in the back saved you. Yes. And I advanced there. All right. Okay, so I actually enjoy these games where we're not keeping score. Yeah. Because I'll be like, hey, stuff. what about this thing? Yeah. I mean, yeah. we can help each other play. Exactly. Yeah. You know? We want a good game for you guys to watch. Good game. Well, maybe, not, maybe not that good of a game. <laughs> Two to one. Oh, yeah, historically you won. Oh. No pressure. No pressure whatsoever. Well, yeah. This is gonna be one. This should be corn of the corn. Yes. This is gonna be two. Mm -hmm. This is gonna be three. Okay. The big man himself. And. They should be side by side because it was a, they were supporting. Okay. So one, two, three. Four. Mm -hmm. No. We'll go there. Four. One, two, 
three, four, five. Orderly, I like it. Uh, well, the elephant's not going to move. Could move him behind and make him 3D. Oh! I'll take bad ideas for a thousand, please. Yeah, right? I don't think I'm going to do anything else. It'll just get me in trouble. It could. Maybe what I'll do is that. Move him somewhere else where he might be useful. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> no problem with command, right? No. Good. <clears throat> Hannibal's in the right place. He's in the right place. <coughs> so let's go with the... Um, that's good that the river turned out like this because that's probably yeah. where the river should be yeah. in the real battle. Yeah, exactly. Because it's kind of frozen. Mm -hmm. um, I'm a four. I'll stay a four. You start at three, two, one. I need a six to survive, probably. Get him! Nope. Oh, they got, got frozen. Yep, got him. Okay. And then let's do a four to four. That's the quick kill me. Yeah. Big number! Nope. Wow. More frozen troops. Come on. That's 20. Ooh, people are going to think Warband are great. We're going to eat them for dinner. I told you they were. <laughs> the bull butter. So that's that. And last is a 2 to 3. I'm the 3. If you win, the game's over. I roll a 6. You live. Aha! You live. All right. Um, Should be back. Behind them. Not too much, but. Well, 20 there. Well, but I'm only at 15. Ah, very good. They went 20 up, but they very went good. 15 back. It's late. Aha. Uh -huh. Pips? Yep. Six. Okay, good, Overkill. Good. Overkill. That well, gives you a, a chance? Much. Yeah. So you're saying there's a chance? There's always a chance. Let's look at this. Doesn't look like I'd be in bad going if I contact him, come over here and go in. No, yeah. You're a three and I'm a four. And we'll lock both of those guys down. I think I need to do that. Okay. Afterwards. Who else will help them? Afterwards. Who else will help him over there? Nobody yet. Not, not just yet. Actually, if he did go there, he could go there. He's definitely going to go there to tie him up. But you need to get something to seal this area up. Because otherwise... You could. Need somebody to come in and, and block yeah, the guy I mean, from coming around the corner. He'll have to come in. Or there. get him the F out of there. No, if you're going to... If you're going to stay, then you got to commit. If you're not going to stay, then you need to pull him back. What's the not, distance here? Not what, how far are we away from each other? We're within. I have to move individually. Oh, otherwise it'd be a bigger hole. So he's he could move individually to here. He could move individually to there. That still leaves this guy rampant. What can this cab do? Two, and he's got to go a smidge, and we'll lift the smidge and a half. So I could get the cab about here. So that'd be one, two, three, four, five, six. I got, I got it to do it. Of course, he's sitting all by him, lonesome. Well, there's not a whole lot anybody can do. The alternative is. I could move the Saloy in here and lock him down. But I'd just be locking him down. And then what do you do with this guy? You know, he's kind of stuck there. Unless he pulls back. Unless he pulls back. But then I have to pull him back too. Which, maybe that's not such a bad thing. Yeah. I've done it many a times. <laughs> oh, I'm a bigger coward than you. Come on. I was like, if I see that kind of going on right there, I'm like, well, that attack's done. We're out. <laughs> I think.
think that's the thing to do. We're going to move one here. You know? Okay. Maybe they won't advance. No. God, he's in a great place, though. How far can he move over? He can move over like this. Oh. And still be even with him. That's not so bad. That's not a bad place for him. I like that. Can I be in... Uh, I like that. That's two. Mm -hmm. That seems reasonable. Now here the sky's the limit. I like it shimmy them all over. Yeah. That's don't two get, so far, right? Don't get too close to the war band. Mm -hmm. Oh, now war band are going to do something. See? See? little bit more than that. Is it as soon as the front edge goes past it? Yes. You get contact and slide over against the elephant. Mm -hmm. That's three. Four. Still four. It's reasonable. Yeah. Well, maybe somebody could take this one. You gotta avoid his threat zone. Remember, you can't it's a half. It. Yeah, go straight so across. So I'm going to need one. So I can get to here and still cross and be on the other side. One, two, three, four. Five. five, six. All right. I, I kind of like that. I would have liked to move him as well, but I'm protecting him. Uh -huh. I like that. Do you have one combat? The Saloy? Uh, two to four. Get him! Nope. All okay. Man. Coming for you. <laughs> All right. Two to three. Two to three. Oh. Hannibal's got thermal underwear. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> There's no way the war band can come over there. So. Have to be Hannibal himself. Hannibal himself. So we'll go individually, one, right? Because otherwise you'd slide that way. Two. Mm -hmm. Three. I'll show you how it's done. Four. Mm -hmm. Five. Mm -hmm. And he can kill that guy. Yeah. Auxiliary can kill them. No, your elephant's not moving. And, <laughs> yeah. So you have to back up half a one. Gives him two and a half left. You should be able to get past the front. 
to, to be here? Oh, to, to be just overlap. beside him? I think so. No, I want to overlap. Right, a smidge over. Yep, yeah. you got it. Need a six there. All right. I think that was still the right move to do with him, though. Yeah. Okay, where are we going first? Uh, let's go three to zero. Big numbers. Four to nine. Yeah, that kills him. Wow. Okay. Um, five to four. Get him. Got, Got me anyways. Okay. And five to three. Oh Got him. Gosh. Wow. Hannibal out of Frozen legions. Here. And just push him into the clouds up there. So, you said he got slaughtered, right? Yeah, I don't but, remember exactly how it Hannibal won. No, so, no the, the one, the guys. So, one of the things that happened, and I haven't read about this battle recently, so if I don't get all the details right, you have to forgive me. We're trying. But they did a, they did an ambush here. The, the Carthaginians put some put some skirmishers in here that caused all kinds of so the Romans went up and they hit them and then the Carthag and then the Carthaginian skirmishers get them from the rear created all kinds of chaos and these guys had just crossed the river and were wet and that doesn't do really well with the cold weather oh the Romans did the Romans yeah the Romans uh, got wet from the river and they were, so so these guys weren't they were already across or no they crossed and got wet correct. And then, what did they end up doing? I don't remember all the uh, details. Yeah. I don't remember all the details, but but it wasn't. It was a closer thing. It probably would have been like a five to three battle. Mm. So, yeah, it was cool. Great. It's cool. There's a lot of. I don't have a lot of variety how I can set up. No, but I. But still, I think you it's can a very, play it a lot of different ways. It, it's very, the river's huge. Yep. I don't know if that's if you want to look at that, Connor, and make sure that it's always a paltry river. Because yeah. I think either if, it was a five or or six, if it's a five or six river, super bad. It's super bad for the Romans. It's super yeah. bad for the Romans. So, yeah, that would be. But the Romans didn't win, so yeah, you know. A very good scenario. I like yeah. this one too. Yeah, no problems. Except okay, that we might want to figure that out. Make sure. That's right. Otherwise, it that's. I would have won if I didn't have a camp. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> okay, folks. See you on the next one. Okay, folks, battle three. The Battle of Lake Tresemine, 217 BC. So the other battle we just did, uh -huh. Hannibal won, uh -huh. right? And he's going through the middle of the winter and everything, and he goes through a swamp. He takes the opposite route, and something happens to his eye. He gets he gets oh, an infection in his yeah. eye, and he loses so his eye. it wasn't a war wound. It was, oops. It was an infection. Yeah, so he's got one eye now. Quit scratching your and eyes. he has no heffalumps because they oh, all froze. Man. No elephant trunks. No heffalumps. That's right. <laughs> so after the Battle of Trebia, Hannibal outflanked Roman armies once again. This time the grueling march was through marshland. I just said that. Nice. And the process, I actually never never read this before. Uh, the process, Hannibal lost sight in one eye. Exactly. That's what I just said. Oh. What remained of his elephants and a significant portion of his armed forces. So left whatever was left the elephants. The march did mean that the Carthaginians re reached Etruria unopposed, however, and, the rab and ravaged the unprotected Italian countryside. Gaius Flaminius, who was controlling one of the two forces sent to block the Carthaginians despite the pillaging, waited for the support of the second army before engaging, unlike Longus. Uh, Hannibal blocked his supply routes to Rome, however, so Flaminius was forced to give up their defensive position and pursue. On the north shores of Lake Trasimene, Hannibal laid a devastating ambush. Here's the lake. Here's the road. Runs beside it. Place the waterway along one board edge. The board edge will be the Roman board edge. And the opposite, the Carthaginian. Place a road parallel and one base width from the waterway. There it is. Connecting to two flank board edges. The Carthaginian places four gentle hills one in each table quarter so they are not within one base width of each other or a board edge. If there is insufficient room on the Roman half of the table, the gentle hills may cross into another table quarter, but only by the smallest amount possible. Each quarter, huh? Yep. And the only restriction is don't come within an edge. A of base the edge. of each other or the board edge. 
I guess it could be right up against the road if you wanted to. Uh -huh. They're kind of drawn in the middle, so. Do what you want. I'm going to deploy first. You're going to be on the road? I'm going to be on the road. Half of my force in front of the baggage and half behind. All right. I'm going to go with that. Okay. Carthaginians include Cavalry General. Yes. A calf. Yes. Two light horse. Yes. Three spearmen. Yes. Two solid war bands. Yeah, boys. A solid ox. Yes. Two saloi. Yep. And a camp. Roman army consists of a cab general, a cab, three blades. Doesn't say whether they're fast or not. We're going to say that they're solid. Most time they got this. Exactly. Four solid auxilia. They're Italian or Latin allies, allies or freshly recruited Romans. And they need a lot more training. Woo! A solo, uh, solid spear, two saloi, and a baggage element. Baggage element is on a 40 by 40 base, and all other aspects act as a camp follower element. Ooh, so it is a two, two zero. zero. Two versus foot, zero versus. Mounted. Yep. Yeah. The Roman army deploys first. First place the baggage element on the center line by secting the road facing one of the flank edges. Well, I'm going to go this way, just to keep it simple. I can either face this way or that way. I'm going to go that way. Yep. Okay. In right in the middle. Yep, there you okay. go. He goes right in the middle. Then all the other Roman troops are, paced in, are placed in column with the baggage element following the road. The Romans must put six elements in column in front of the baggage and the same number behind. Woo! Hello. Who wants to walk through the horse tongue? <laughs> Oh. Standard victory conditions. Roman baggage does does count as an element destroyed. So it's four. I'm going to put two of these guys here. Two of these guys here. All the newbies. All the newbies, yeah. We'll put two blade in front, a blade and a spear behind. One and one or two and two? We'll lead with the general. Wow. Well, I'm just thinking. I'm just thinking. I'm going How would these guys march through here? I'm just, you know. I'm going with you. I don't think they'd split the newbies up. <laughs> hey, you can play however you want when you're the wrong <laughs> Okay. I'm thinking the newbie. I'm thinking the Saloy are out front, and the newbies are at the back, and all the good guys are up next to me. I just don't want it so you, <laughs> you can pick on the, the handicapped. Aha. Uh -huh. You know, you're saying, trying to think of how they would do it, so. <laughs> when I ran the Roman army, this is how we're going to do it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Carthaginian player deploys second, uses the standard deployment rules. The exception is that the three spear elements must be deployed in a single group on the Roman half of the board and with at least one element in contact with the flank board edge of the Roman column is facing. All right, what in the F did that just say? So they're going to be able to hear anything. Oh, look, it even shows the Romans facing this way. Aha! And the spear over so here? The spear over there, yeah. They're they're already here. Yeah, but let me change how I'm deployed because I didn't. Oh, you didn't part. know that. Okay. I didn't know all that. Nah. If you're gonna be there. I don't then... want the general leading. <laughs> well, no, I want all I want all the guys that are that are gonna fight spear up here. Ah. I'm going with you. Exactly. Let's put all the good guys over here. And now the general's gonna be in the back of the column. No, the general. <laughs> the general can be up here. 
Make sure it's six. The general can be up here. So we got blade, 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 and spear, and the general up there. Yeah, I'm okay with the general being up there. And, the, and That's my fine. spear. Okay, so your spear, well, you have to place a camp normally. I don't think your camp's in danger. Maybe, you never know. Three my spear elements must be employed a single group on the Roman half of the board with at least one element in contact with a flag board edge. The Roman column is facing. So it's like a littoral landing, it's like a with, littoral the, landing. with the uh, board edge. But I could do it like this. Could be in a column. Yeah. My, I'll match your column with my column. And Carthaginians are going to go first. Oh, that's, hmm. Maybe I don't want to worry about it then. Maybe I just want to do this. I think I'll do that. Yep, I'll do that. Okay. Yes, and then, your first. then everything else is the same. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yep. Standard deployment. None shall pass. Well, the first two battles were fun. This one looks like it's this fun, too. looks interesting, too. Yep. Yeah. Uh... These are all gentle hills. Makes a big difference what kind of hills they are. Yeah. Big difference. All right. So I'm going with a Saloy Saloy, two light horse, solid ox, two solid war bands, uh, Hannibal, Cav, three solid spear. Okay. And I've got a cavalry general, blade, blade, blade. Spear, solid ox, baggage element, solid ox, solid ox, solid ox, soloi, soloi, cap. And you go first. And the cartels go first. All right, well, let's see. If you'd set up on the road. You could have multi-moved and gone to combat with the general on the first bound. Oh yeah. And killed him. Didn't see but that not, coming, did no, you? No, I, I didn't. You didn't either. I think what I need to do. So that's why you don't lead with the general. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm gonna do. All these games are a surprise to all of us. Hello. Oh, e oh, oh, shit. We'll be one. Okay. Yeah, you got to move forward there. Yeah, well, I, and I got thinking like, well, if, if I don't, if I spend all my pips over here like I wanted to, if you multi and down the road, you'll have one guy fighting and kill guy instantly for no recoil. That's right. And don't think I won't do that. Yeah, that's right. I knew you would do that. So. <laughs> what in doubt? Attack the yes. Romans. Attack, attack, attack. So I decided to not do the multi... Because uh, I was going to multi-move these guys. But that's yeah, those Saloy are only going to be able to multi-move the very first bound. Yeah. Because there's no well, I thought going. about I thought about doing it uh, this 
bound so they'd be up in here. Scare the shit out of you. What about scaring the shit out of you? Oh, you know it. Oh, Who's I like Saloy. I do like Saloy. Okay, no shooting. No shootings again. I have a feeling we're not going to have any shooting today. Oh. It's kind of nice not having any shooting. It definitely huh. speeds the game up. Yes. Pips, you know the nice thing about not having any shooting? People don't ask shooting questions. Mm -hmm. People yeah. don't shoot their mouth about it. Pips, don't be a sissy foot. You sissy yeah. foot. Jeez. You candy ass. How did you know that ahead of time? Right? You I, I, candy I, 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 ass general. What's this guy's name? Gaius Flaminius. Flaminius. Gaius <laughs> Fla Flaminius. You gotta move the general. I have to move the general. Yeah, I have to move the general. The question is, where do you move him to? I can move him over in here in the center. Yeah, I'm gonna get him the F out of the way. Yeah, get him out of the way. No, get him the F out of the way. Yeah, that, that too. I guess I could put him up on the hill, but there's no guarantee that we're gonna fight there. Oh. I just left something in there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> gotta watch those carcanos. They're like watching you. You. Dink. Up here on old Rocky Top. Okay. All right. Well, still no shooting. Well, I should get hosed, because that's what happened historically. Except, except he died in here. In the he, ocean? Yeah, he, I'm pretty sure he died in the ocean. A lot of guys tried to get away, and they couldn't get away. He got pushed up against the ocean. Bad things. Ocean Lake. Lacus. Lacus Maximus. Lacus Maximus. You know, swimming with metal heavy armor. Mm-hmm. Bad combination. Gets them every time. So, the Viking thing we just had. Yeah. Scott's got me watching the Vikings again. Oh, yeah? Which, I don't remember half of it. I didn't know Floki didn't swim. Oh. How can you build boats and not swim? Floki doesn't swim? How can you, I don't understand how people didn't swim a long time ago. Like, uh -huh. you're, you're by the frickin' ocean. Uh-huh. It's cheap entertainment. Uh -huh. Especially if you don't make it. <laughs> What's that guy thrashing around for? I don't know. Applause. <clears throat> Clap at him. Yeah. Floki. That's three. Okay. Here comes another one. No. Uh, yeah, it's a game. I could push forward. Yep. But it's going to take two pips. Two pips and whatever it is will hit and go to here. Silly bastards. Within two. Yes. Have a little bit of a smidge of a thing here. It's going to be interesting. Or as you would say, interesting. Uh huh. What's the holdup? <laughs> Did that cart break down again? Damn it. Oh well, might as well connect to Pornhub. <laughs> well, back then Marty it's... said I always mention it, so I'm just gonna mention it every every time now. <laughs> it's gonna be the new Rutabaga. Gotcha! <laughs> <laughs> it's either that or you might as well get the hippo women out. <laughs> the hippo women on, on <laughs> Pornhub. <laughs> Well, that's their... Wow. Get the Apple women out. Hope you got a widescreen TV. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do that. I don't know if it's right. <laughs> we'll find out. All right. Okay, there's my three. You're up. A two. Oh, 
Oh, that's a column, isn't it? That is. What is? Well, those two guys are. Yeah. He's not connected. No, I know. Yeah. Mm hmm Yeah. But they're in line, right? Yes. Yep. These two are connected, and he's connected side to side. Keeps me from getting pulled. So the war band would be able to close the door, but this guy can. I gotta do it. Do it while you can. I'm gonna get a height on you. Not that that matters to you. And you can go there. Well, gops to do it. Oh, except. Is he over or not? I guess he, whatever he was, he may have oh, been then over. I can't do it. Then maybe you don't want that's to do that. Maybe you don't want to do that. Well, that's why I was asking if he was over. Because then I can't do it. It looks like he was over. He's, he's wherever okay. he was. Okay. There wasn't some master plan. I moved these guys over. I did move even farther yep. if I could, but. No, if I could close the door, I was going to do that. But if I can't, I'm not going to do that. Because the chance to kill two guys, you got to do it. <clears throat> All right. So I got two pips. Let's go with. Um, Spin them all over there. Yeah. I don't. I don't think that's the solution. That's the winner. Yeah. Maybe if you roll a six. I think what we'll do. Is jam you up. <laughs> we'll just Already. Do, we'll just, just do get it, it right ready. now. Yep. Yep. Just get it ready. All it takes is one. We're going. Oh shit. Just break your guys. We're going up. So that guy is gonna go. I'm holding the hill down. Yeah. Stuff's working pretty good. Is he gonna yeah, have a guy behind him? Yep, guy be, will be behind him and this guy will be Here's for the guy behind him. I think I wanna be closer though. I don't wanna give you any room to maneuver. I think I'm gonna go as close I can get I can almost get right up on you. Oh, you gonna get closer? I think so. Yeah, I don't want to give you any room to maneuver. I gotta be some negative. And we gotta switch these two guys. Well, he doesn't. But he's alright. Is he alright? No. Alright, he's not. <laughs> so that's one. Mm -hmm. And from my second. Yeah, I think you got to keep pushing that up there. Well, what I don't want to do, I don't want to threaten you. So I'm just going to move. And I'm not threatening. You're moving straight ahead? Yeah. Yeah, move them straight ahead. I don't want to threaten them. Okay, you're out. Yep. Okay. That's two. That's okay. it. You don't have a third one? Nope, I only had two that time. Oh, okay. I said, I'm looking at the three. That's not you. That's you. Why are you looking at me? Um, Your pips. There you go. Dice aren't going to roll themselves. Oh. Weird. This is weird. But it's a good scenario. I like it again. Right, it should be a cluster for me. I'm going to move this guy here. It's like me. the opposite of the one I played. <laughs> the opposite of what? Of the first one. So the kind of, yeah, is, kind of. Now it's a Roman's kind of, turn. Uh, kind of, yeah. Being a column. No, it's nice that it's a cluster, yeah. you know? But when I play with Joel, we do DBN, and sometimes um, I'm, I'm going to have to turn. I'm going to have to turn both of them, wheel them, and then come over to you. 
There's a column. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. Well, I can't do it individually as I don't fit. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do that. They're both locked down, so. Yep. That's your two. That's my two. Right or wrong, I don't care if you close the door on me. Well, I mean, it may even be a, well, who cares? That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. It might just kill me and then it solves all my problems. <laughs> okay, so this guy is a four to a three. I think, that. I think you're uphill on that Yeah, no, here. yeah, I'm, I'm uphill on that one, so I'm a five. I, I think here. all of them. Yes, five to three here. Let's try to get something. Six. Uh, to nine. So you recoil. 20. Probably you're gonna get the back of the war man. No, you'll be past or that. Or Because you're, because you're, whatchamacallit, deep. Man, everybody needs a stick yeah, Everybody's gonna have to be stuck up. <laughs> uppity, all uppity. And then a six to three. Correct. Get him! Oh, nine. Nine to five. I live! Wow, that's a... Okay, so he goes 15 back. Should be like that. And I come forward. Yep, the column. With the column. Forward. Yep, the whole column comes forward. Okay. Okay. All right. Roll one. Five is the number. Yeah, it's I should, interesting. I should have put that hill here. <laughs> huh? like, oh, because of, yeah, well, we're going to buy more. Ladder. We're going to be buy, we'll buy more of these. Assuming, you know, assuming they don't put a mask mandate in the yeah. store, we'll go. Exactly. We'll plan on going and put a mask mandate and we're out. We're out. You guys are on your own again. All right. So he can get there. Don't go in your threat zone. That seems like a thing to do there. Or to just ignore and use Hannibal to do it. Bum, ba, da, bum. Oh, last time he threw him in, he was effective. Yeah. He was a, he was a supporter. All right. I think... He was a supporter. That's, this is what everybody's here for. Let's, oh yeah, I see people killed. Let's get this rolling. There's mm -hmm. one there. This is going to be two. Uh, was he completely beside him? Yeah, he was, okay. he was over. Because okay. I knew I knew it's something I wanted to do. Mm -hmm. um, one, two... This ain't no Queen's Gambit. We want to see people. We want to see people dead. Dead figs. I want to. I'd like to know. Hmm. I don't know where my fifteen is. Oh, he might not be able. To. If they go forward, which way are they? If these guys move forward. He's going to go this way. Good. That's what I want. Mm -hmm. And is that, where will he end up? I will be here. But you'll be there. There's still got enough room for, to close. Hold, I think hold so. that guy? I think so. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. So they got to go first. Here's one for him. Yeah. Here's one for him. The spear got to go first. Spear guys push forward. And slide and the human blade two, slides over. One, two, three. Before he moves out of. I'm supposed to die in the water, not up on a hill. Gosh. <laughs> it's funny that I've gotten a shitty pip rolls. As I probably should have. Wait, is that where I want to go with him? Look out. Oh, oh well, I am at the edge. Never mind. False alarm. As you were. I think we'll wheel. No command issue? No, because before I move him, I want to do that. Gotcha. We'll do that. I'm not going to have the I'm not going to have the pips to roll to move most of my guys over here. You, 
They're kind yeah, of like an ambush it. mode. So that should be fine. Did you put a stick on them? No. Yeah, just hanging it on the. It needs to be taller. Front. So that's fine. One, two, three, four. Five. What's this? No. Oh, I was gonna. I was gonna. Not appearing it. in this film. I was. was, gonna, was <laughs> Sir, not appearing in I this film. I wanted to know where that guy was gonna be. Mm. Um. Now you're double overlapped on the blade. I am. So, that so my down blade is a five. Up to six. Up to six. Down, down to five. Down to four. So and you're also a four. four. And you'll kill both of them. Yep. And you did. Oh my gosh. I, that's kind of weird. So what happens when you roll a one? Now and the you're, band got a you're going to 20. advance twenty, so that's going to put you about there. Wow. Yeah. Getting you your see. uphill yet? Okay. So you're a four. No, you're a five. Down to a three. Three to three. Correct. See what this Gaius is made out of? Whoa, he's fighting when he puts it in the corner. That's a nine total. I'm a five. So Sorry. you recoil. Assuming you want to go thirty. Yep. Yep. And this guy recalls 20. What a mess. And He's like, um, excuse me. <laughs> and then a 5 to a 3. Okay. I'm a 6 total. And I'm a 9. Okay, and I'm going to recall up to it. Okay. Okay. Back now, to if you. I roll a 1, I'm doomed. Yeah. Just so you know. Just hope not. Yay, you can do stuff. Kind of doomed. Well, for starters, I, I got to do this and yep. this. Yeah. Yes. I have to. The wise thing would be to move out. You're still uphill there. No, I'm not going forward. I don't fit. No, no, no. No, I'm saying, like, you might not have to move him yet. Well, let's see what his You're options five. are. Let's see what his options are. Yeah, and he's fighting somebody that's kind of shitty. I'm not saying yeah. kind of shitty, but he's not the, your general or something. But these two can't do a lot to him. Even if he hit him from the side to take away your your um, uphill advantage, it won't be until next turn that I can capitalize on it. Because I can't close the door at this angle. If I want him to turn this way to get him away from the hill, it's not going to... It'll take two turns to get an advantage on him. I think I need to move him. Yep. Yeah, I think, I think your general's fine. I don't think... Well, he's, he's not fine, but... He's okay. What's he going to do? Fall back here and then yeah. give you an advantage? Right. You I can only move straight back. Yep. I can go after him. That's probably the second best thing. Nah, you, you want to... But I only have an advantage of one over him. Yeah. No, so, you, you I think him. moving him out of the way is the correct move. I think you're right. He's up against him. Yeah, you get. That's where we're at. Yeah. Oh, his front edge can't. Man, if he could reach and close the door on that guy, mm. I'd do that. Yeah. You know what? You know? Yep. I was wondering. I wanted to get get some height advantage. I thought about here. going up on the hill, but I'm like, nah, 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 you. Well, you only have so many pips. You yeah. know, you never know what's going to be. That was thrown in front of you. How to do it? Yep. I didn't have the pips to move a guy back and move a guy in. I'm like, yeah. ah, what? Do you, you know, I could have blown you up. I almost did. Yeah. Didn't work out. Uh huh. Hey, I'm supposed to lose. <laughs> Let's go here. Where yeah. We're five five. Five five. Come on. Ten. Ooh. Six. No, not quite. And then here. Four, four. Four, four. Get him! Lock. Lock. You're up. 
A two. two. Okay, just some boat. A little bit. A little bit. It's it's a cool battle. Mm -hmm. I'd play this again. Yeah. There's lots of ways you can play the Carthaginians. Lots of ways. You can keep these guys here. Probably not the right move. Man, two pips. Mm-hmm. Not quite. Nope. Yeah, it'd be hard to pass up. Um, that would be hard to pass up. I'm looking at, he goes forward and he closes the door, but it's still not pretty bad. high high numbers. But it's not bad. Me. Or I go right back in here. Again, it's about the same. This is like even up here. And I get, well, that'll win I got, you the game. I got one advantage there. That'll win you the game. This gives you an advantage and moves your guys in a, so in, a, in, a, in a better situation. Not that you're in a but bad situation. I don't situation. think it's a bad situation there. No, it's not a bad situation. I'm going to go for the win. Okay. We'll see what this guy's made out of. Yeah. I'm going to try that. Three to three. This guy was... He, they, the reason they found him, super fancy dressed. Uh, <laughs> Ah, hey, they don't call him Flaminius for nothing. I'm going to the beach. <laughs> Careful. That's the only one? No, we got another one down here. Yeah. Which oh, one let's do? do this one first. Go uh, four or four. Lock. Wow. Six, six. And three, three. Get him! The lock would hurt you. It's a six. And so I'm a no, nine. No, you're a nine. And I'm a five. Almost killed him again. Almost don't count. Back to you. Okay. Pips. Need about a nine. <laughs> three. That's the highest pips I've gotten. Actually, I'd be okay having a, a three every time. Yeah, you can. I can do something yeah. with that. Better than a one. Well, I don't care if you lock me down. He, he, that's where he needs to be to have a height advantage. Three, huh? Is he threatened by him? I don't think he is. No. Okay. Yeah, I've thought about putting him here, but depending how I put him, you can get a height advantage on him. That's well, not good for him. You got a, yeah, but you got a chance to move him out. Yeah. Otherwise, something goes awry, and I move forward. I'm gonna lock him down. It goes here. what? Awry! Awry! Oh, awry! <laughs> But the only bad thing is, if something does go awry, then there's nobody in front of your baggage, though, either. Yeah. Yeah, the baggage is worth one. And he fights like a sissy. Yeah. Well, he may throw sixes around, like, there's nobody's, there's no tomorrow. Who knows? <laughs> yeah. He's, he's, he's got to move up. Oh, wait a minute. There's no, he, he's, there's no way he's standing up there. Huh. <laughs> okay. That's one base whip there. One base with there. No point in being in line with him. He's he's even sideways yep. with him. Okay. Well, the good thing is he took away on my quick quill. You still got one pit left. I do. I do. I think he still needs to hold there. Mm hmm He's a five. I think we need to move this away up on the hill. Well, you auxilia. That guy is so freaking slow. One combat. Four, four. Get him! Push you. No. Staggered freaking line here. 
Oops. Move that spear guy back on. Mm -hmm. Yep. There's one. Yep. yep. It's a five to three. Which is a winning number as far as I'm concerned. One. Two. Three. Oh, good. Now you're closer to my elements. They can contact you. Yeah, he moves for one. And so does he. he was. Yep. These no guys would cost two if I try and move them. So far, one, two, three. Huh. It's a fun battle. Yeah. There's a lot of ways to go about it. Does the war band, the front one, can he move here and then slide? Well, as long as he fits. So you're going to have to rotate. What kind of distance do we have here? We have like a three quarters of one. And then his corner's here. Yeah. He can go there. You know what? I'm going to try it because this will start to give me an uphill take away yours mm. I'll do that I was thinking about going there but I think the more important thing is to get you away from oriented the in a different direction so that I can't, you can't I can't keep fighting with the hiding yeah. damage that way yep no hopefully it doesn't get you killed that's the deal right well you haven't taken a loss no yeah and I, you don't have to pay those efforts then yeah that's right okay so, Shh, don't let him hear you uh -oh. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> three combats. I'll go here first? Yep, five to three. Five to three. It's five to three is always scare me as being the three. Well, mm -hmm. I could live with that. Okay. Three to two. Let's see what these Italian allies are made yeah. out of. I need a four, four. or higher. Yeah. Nope. Need more training. <laughs> <laughs> and now I'm a two, but I'm uphill gives me a three. And you're a four. four. Yep. So I'm a six total. You recalled me. I'm going to go back 40. Been nice that guy would have held. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm not supposed to win. <laughs> Just saying. Now, hey, he should be, because he was perfectly aligned with that, and you turned him, yep. he should be perfectly aligned with the side so he's not locked yep. down by him. Yep. Okay. It's your turn. A one would be bad. No, you go three. See? I get another three. <laughs> another three. Yep. Why would I want to roll anything different? Wow. What a fiasco. Well. I could throw a guy there. Yep. And then use this guy to turn him. Yep. And I fight this one first. And let me see. I mean, I, can, I just don't think it's worth it to move him back and then get him in. I think this guy should just do fine. And give me a height on him. Mm -hmm. I think that's one. And then move this guy into the breach. Yep. And I got one left over. Yep. Two to two with a quick kill for me. Yeah. I think I need to do that. I'm need to make some we need to make something happen. Yeah. I mean I'm within one of dying, so I might as well go on the offense. Yeah. He turns the face. We're gonna fight this combat first. Two to one to two. No, I'm a three. Yeah, I'll get one to three. I'm a four. You wanna go thirty? Yeah. So you have an overlap? Yep. Well, you'd still have the overlap if you go forty. Yeah, let's do 40 then. So they can move together. They can move together, right. Uh, Here. Three to two. I recoil. That's it. Oh, two to two. Two to two. Come on! Oh, oh. that's annoying. I'm going to go back 40. 
They hold. Back on the freaking hill. We'll go back. We'll go, we'll back, go, back, go back, back on the damn hill. Oh, never mind. Oh, oh, they're armed with that. Oh, never mind. Ooh. Roll one. Three. We got no kills for the no kills for the Carthos. Tony Itis. No, I roll fives and sixes. Actually, mine were just combat rolls. Oh, Tony Itis in this game, yes. Uh -huh. You got Flaminia. You got a bad case of Flaminia. Hmm. I could push the gamut up there again, but it would probably take too much. That's a solid wall. That's mm -hmm. too much shoving. And I don't want to go up there. I think the only advantage of the guy is again around your leader. You could throw him in. Yeah. You'd have a height advantage yeah. and close the door on his ass. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what? What I should do is that is use him and have him close the door. You could do that too. Number. You could do that too. Uh, as long as he's but, within. Now, nah, you can contact the front and you'll get the slide over. Where's the two? Oh, here it is. Question is. No, you're exactly two. Him? You're exactly two. Oh, okay. But if you're not exactly even with him, you can't make it because it's diagonal then. I think you're exactly even. I'll give it to you. Do it. Do him now. All right, let's try. Yep. There's one. And then he comes over here. There's two. Uh huh. I got one left. All I gotta do is roll six again. I don't think he needs. Tall to, order. I don't think he needs to be up here anymore. <laughs> Give him some. What's no, going wait. on here? What's going on down here? Oh, don't be looking at him. Don't look at him. Wait, I guess. <laughs> don't give him the stare. Don't. You at least freak. You him. me now. <laughs> you always freak the guys out now with your one eye. Everybody's scared. Stop staring at him with your bad eye. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here, Hannibal? Oh, oh, he's <laughs> over there. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. Uh, that's uh, my four to your three. Yep. Wow. Dead. All right. But massacre. That's, it's interesting. The it's pips, a massacre. The pips could have been better for you to get more. Yeah, I don't think it's here. a really unbalanced game. No. Um, it just he had a I could have a lot better pips. Yeah, I I because it takes them a lot. This group is going to take a long time getting into combat. Mm -hmm. That could also take a long time getting into combat. I just brought poor pips. Well, that's why I kept them moving every turn. And I, yeah. the first turn you could have double. I could double move them, but I didn't. Have yeah, pips. I think you did the right. I thing. thought it was more important to get off my back because I know what you do. Ah! <laughs> I would. I just do it just to see what would happen. Yeah. And it w at the same time, if there was a column, if you move the whole, that brings him ever so closer. Exactly. Ever so slightly. Ever so slightly closer to your objective. Okay. Well, Roman's lost is, uh, though I didn't die up on the hills. Nope. On the bottom. Yeah, died over here. <laughs> okay. All right. We'll see the next one. The battle everybody's been waiting for. This is historically one of the battles that is the hardest to get right in every rule set. Every. So we'll see how Connor does with this one. I have no idea. I have faith in Connor. I like the first three. There. Yeah, the first three battles were good. Doesn't matter who won. I think. I like the first one the best. I think, <laughs> I think the wait. First. I used Warman in that one. What's wrong with uh -huh. me? The first and of the two columns are awesome. So. So the first thing you should notice about this, if you're watching it, it's battle four. <laughs> it's battle number four. It's a thirty by thirty inch board, which looks massive. When's the last time we played on a thirty by thirty? It's been a while. Probably um, collision course. Well, no. Yeah. No. Well, we, yeah, we made collision course. We made used collision to course. use it. Until yeah, we're doing collision course on twenty fours yeah. now. And it, we like, it's it's no, time, no, more timely. No. Yeah. So it's a thirty by thirty inch board. This is the battle of Cani. It's the hardest one to get right. So there's going to be special rules in here, some weirdisms in here, and we'll see how this plays. Hopefully it'll be fun. If it's anything like the first three, it'll be a hoot. I think so. Okay. 
Battle of Cannae. The following the disaster of Lake Tresemene, yep, it was, the Romans appointed Quintus Fabius Maximus Vericosus Ver Ver as dictator. Fabius followed a policy of defense. I've never heard him called anything other than Fabius Maximus. Okay, Fabius followed a policy of defense, shadowing but not engaging the Carthaginians. Keep away. This policy proved unpopular among Roman society. Yeah, because Hannibal would go and attack. He'd like burn down a village. He's like, oh, we'll do this, and now they have to come and play. And the Romans were like, no, we're not going for that. So he's playing keep away. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, the situation came to a head when Hannibal managed to escape Fabius' blockade in Campania. The dictator was replaced by two consuls. So it's like, dictators only served for six months. So it's like, oh, we'll go back to the book, back there, two consuls. Gaius Terentius Varro and Lucius Aemilius Paulus. No more Longus. No more Longus. I don't know what happened to him. Uh, the Romans hoped now to win through sheer weight of arms and raise the largest force they ever had, somewhere between 50 and 100,000 men. Command of this force was split between the con two consuls who took turns by day to whom was an overall command. Understanding his allied Gauls and Iberians to be the weaker of his infantry and the aggressiveness of the Romans, Hannibal encircled the much larger Roman forces and inflicted a defeat which is argued to be the worst in all of Roman history. It is. Even more than Adrianople. Uh -huh. Easy. Because like the Romans lost like freaking 80,000 people. Oof. It just brutal. But you know, if the Romans are one thing, it's stubborn. Yeah. They just raise more armies. Yeah. Uh, 30, 30 inch square battlefield. Place a waterway on one board edge representing the river Ophidus. Ophidus. The two board edges on the flank of this waterway will be the Carthaginian and Roman board edges, respectively. Carthaginian army consists of cavalry general. I wonder who he is. Yeah. It's his moment. Oh, one eye. <laughs> it's his moment. By the way, he's survived every battle so far. Uh huh. And done okay. Yeah. Well, he did okay in the first one, and mm -hmm. he did well in the last two. Yeah. Even with only one good eye. Cav gen a cab general, Cav. Yep. Two light horse. Yep. Yep. Three solid spearmen. Yep. Two solid war bands. A solid auxilia. Mm -hmm. Two saloi. Yep. And a camp. Ta -da. The Roman army. Now for something completely different. Cavalry General. Eight, eight blades. So this is a stand of eight blades. Okay? And there's going to be special rules for them, no doubt. Two, three, I don't need to put them on here. Because people know what they are. I'm just going to have to take them off. So eight stands of this. So 16 stands of blade, basically, that behave like eight, eight blades. Yep. Okay? And then three saloi. Three saloi and a camp as well. Deployment and starting the battle. The Romans deploy for it first. The double blade elements are placed so that four elements have their front edge three base widths away from the center line. So where's the center line? Here. Do we need... I don't know if we need that yet. The double base elements are placed so that four elements have their front edge three base widths from the center line. They must be deployed in a single group, evenly spaced on either side of the center line, parallel to the waterway. So let's just go ahead and put them down. How many? Four? Uh, so, so the center line is where? Right. I think there, right? Okay. So this is one. Here's two. This is one. Here's another one. Here's another one. And here's another one. This is four stands. Okay, make mm -hmm. sure it matches the picture. Wrong picture. Yes. They must be deployed to single group, evenly spaced either side of the center line of the waterway. The remaining four blades are then placed directly behind the first line. So that you have a single group of four elements wide by two deep. So these guys go here. These guys go here. These guys go here. These guys go here. This is four elements of eight blade. Okay. 
All the remaining forces, including the Carthaginians, deploy using the standard rules. And I go first. So, let's make sure we got this right. Looks like we can deploy. No, looks like we did this wrong. So, I have to, the same thing, but I set up down back here. At least that's what the map shows. So I set up there. I can just set up everybody else in, in different ways. So. The three solar and the captain. <laughs> yeah, we're going to put. Does it matter where the camps are? Oh, yeah, I'll put the camp in the middle. My cab general, I will put him. Oh, he's still got to stick him. Um. He can go either way. Yeah, it doesn't seem right. Let's do... That's what we're going to do. So I got a Saloy, a Saloy, a Saloy, Cab General, an eight blade, 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 an eight blade. Okay, so let's before you set up, let's find out what the capabilities of these guys are. So standard rules, standard victory conditions apply for this battle. The only exception is that the first double elements killed do not count as two. So they don't count as two elements killed. Special rules, double elements or groups containing a double element cost an extra pip to move. Oh. With the following exceptions. If the double element starts in a threat zone of an enemy, uh -huh. if the element or at least one element in the group contacts an enemy element with its front edge, i.e. starts a combat or closes the door, if any double elements move directly forwards for their whole entire, for their whole tactical move. So if the double elements move directly forward, not yep. if they go straight forward, they cost one pip to move. Uh -huh. If I move a little bit of an angle, it's going to cost an additional one. Uh -huh. If I go into combat, it, it, will, it will only cost one. Okay? Uh -huh. And they don't count double kill. If somebody's in your threat zone, it only costs one. If the element... Any, if the element or at least one element in the group contacts an enemy element with its front edge. Costs one. If the double element starts in the threat zone of an enemy, yes, it only costs one. So it looks like... You're hampered by movement. Yeah, okay, so they're a double element. So are they, uh, are they one better in combat? They should be, because they're a double element, an eight blade, and the special rule is double elements add plus one when in front close combat against enemy foot. Well, they're a freaking six. But only threes against mounted. But only threes against mounted. Now you know what you got to do. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And... Blades can't kill light horse. Correct. Ever. Blades can't kill Saloy. Correct. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Oh, is there any restrictions for... You set up like normal. Like normal. Mm-hmm. But I go first. Mm-hmm. I mean, the Romans go first. Oh. And lots of people have opinions about this battle. I think you gotta you gotta give the Romans to somebody who's never played a war game before to do it right. Let's 
It'll be interesting. Mm -hmm. I hope you slaughter me. We'll try. Well, I'm not going to, you know, I'm not going to give up. Oh, you're not? No. So I got to work at this? Not today. Of course. So I have 12 elements, actually. Interesting. Oh, you're not gonna put your camp straight, straight forward, so I can't just mark for march for your camp. What? Shit, I gotta defend my camp. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's a 30-inch board. Yeah, it looks like half-ass naked right now. Well, it's interesting. The Saloy, there's no point in throwing the Saloy in the camp because they're no better than the camp followers. Because uh -huh. the camp followers is a two-zero. Use the higher number. To use the two to defend. Yeah. It's plus two, so it's a four. If you throw the Saloy, it's still a four. Yeah. No advantage. No. So I got it. I could take an eight blade and move them back into the camp. Ooh. <laughs> There's that. Uh, your hippo woman will be safe then. Your, your who? <laughs> your hippo woman will be safe. You have the hippo women. Oh, you yeah. capture them all in the last battle. That's yes. what slowed us down. All right. <laughs> uh, oh, one eye. And then uh, two solid war bands. Solid ox. Uh huh. Cab. Saloy. Three solid spear. Right. Saloy. Light horses. Two of them. Okay. I got the first bound. Here goes. Here goes Can I. Six. So the question is, I would say they still get to move one in the first turn. Yeah. Right? It doesn't say. Special rules, double elements or groups containing a double element cost an extra pip to move. But on the first turn, it doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. Nah, we're going to move forward. We're going to play these guys how they were played, even if it's wrong. I'm not keeping track of these wins and losses in, on these well, scenario just, games. It's an interesting. I'm going to move them forward. Yeah. I'm going to move them forward. That's what they. That's what they did. That's what they're going to do. Do you know what historically what happened? I think they. Uh, put he, yeah, he put he put like his Spanish and and Gauls in the middle, and they gave way, and the other guys just crunched and munched on the ends, and just caved in on itself. Uh -huh. All right, what do we have here? We got Warband over here and some more, okay. We got these guys and over there, okay. Got it, um, got it. Okay, so that's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Burn the last one. All right. A three. I think you got to make a ton of special rules for this one to go off, but I don't have a whole lot of interest in that. I don't have a, a how did I say, a hard on for this battle. <sighs> This, this looks cool. Yes. I'm not building eight blade elements, though. <laughs> for one battle. There's one. Mm -hmm. Two. I mean, the 30 inch board looks massive when you play 24 and 24 and 24 and 24 and then it's not that much bigger uh -huh. three 
Okay. You know what? Yeah. You move them with them? Yeah. Okay. Easier to go with them. Okay. Now a bunch of ones is bad. Five. That's four. Yep. Okay. Two. Another two. So again, it was one of those, it doesn't say it in here, but it's one of those, I command on this day, I command on the other day, I command on this day. Yeah. One guy didn't want to attack, Varus wanted to attack, it was a day to attack, he attacked. And then he went and survived. <laughs> and he got the other guy killed. Dick move. I'm going to move all these guys forward for one, straight forward. Uh-huh. And that'll be your turn. Seems reasonable, right? Uh-huh. Let's see how these rules. Let's see how these yeah. rules play. These guys are gonna stay there. Oh. Yeah. We flanky. <laughs> flanky Flankelstein. Flanking. Yeah. Flanky Flankelstein. A two. We heard about those hippo women. Well, we're gonna find out. Yeah. You wanted the camp because you're hungry? No, we're thirsty. <laughs> we want those hippie women. <laughs> this is an interesting scenario. Wow. I like it already. It's different. Okay. Pips. No shooting. Yeah. Six. Mm. Well, now I'm going straight forward. Mm -hmm. This is important. And you know where he is. I don't lock him down. And that's important, yeah. Because I'm going to spend two pips to be able to 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 smooth to move over a tiny little bit and lock them down. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's two put two pips down the drain. Is this an option? It is. I don't think I've got to do it. Locks two guys up. For now, mm -hmm. that's three, but we'll do it last. So if we need it for anything, it is. Wow. This is a cool. This is cool. I, I got interesting. Interesting things. Uh huh. So I want to take a good chunk of these and point them and head them that way. I've used up three, so I can move another group straight and another one at an angle a little bit. Or all of them at an angle.
That uses up another two. So now we got one, one left over. What does this look like? Looks like it just locks him down. Mm, no bueno. Look at something. I mean, I'm gonna do it before I move, so right. I'm okay. Right. But I'm just like for the future. Do I really want to out, out, extend our, myself? I like the 30 inch board better. Uh -huh. I just don't like that it consumes the entire table, and we're like. But it, but I like it because but you can be out of command. Yeah. Now you're with no terrain. Yeah. You know. Now you're stretched. Yeah, I think I think I want to put these guys in a position where. They can react to each other. Because these guys can kind of negate them. Okay. No combats. Oh, I won. No, there is a combat. Oh, there is? Yep. Is that your four, pick? Four, or that's the combat? No, that's combat. Four okay, to three. So four to three. I want to go full 40. You want to go the full? And you don't want to go through. <laughs> that would be stupid. So that way yeah, he's, You want the Saloy free. He's free. Free to be. That's what I want. Okay. Okay. Now you're pit. Pit. Notice that. One pit. No. That would not make a good... There we go. Right. It was all part of your plan. <laughs> no. So this guy's free. This guy's free. Blades can kill calves. They can. So we're giving them the plus ones against foot. So they're right. sixes. Correct. But they're three against mounted. Yes. Um, can. He get to here. Well, he's locked down. He's not. He's not. Correct. No. No. He can't get to there. Oh. He's on his own. Could get an overlap. So, I can buy one more turn. And the bad thing is, is I, assuming you wanted to go into combat, you can't just wheel them and go in because you'll slide this way. Right. You know, and, and I would imagine you would want to put these guys here and him here and then an overlap. If, if you wanted to go into combat. Now, what would Hannibal do? I think what I do need to do, I got six. All right. What I really need to do is to break that up. Do you remember to sacrifice the children? We ran out. <laughs> Fresh out. Fresh out of kids. So. T 
to make that work. That work. All right, so that so we've got about that much left. I need to stay out. You have, well, you could, if this guy's tied down, he could wheel, he could wheel and they could fight, right? If who's tied down? This guy. Well, right now he's locked in by both. Right? You have him threatened. Oh, uh, it could be. Yeah. Let's still you check that And I was moving towards you, so. No, I wouldn't have been able to move forward. When this corner goes even with you, yeah. i got to start turning this way. Yeah, one. exactly. That's why I'm okay there. So really, he has to pay attention to him. He does, he yes. He does not. Correct. That's correct. So he could slide and hit him in the front and he can come in and close the door on him. But I need at least, well that's two So, so then yeah. I do need to tie him down. Yeah, you got to do something there. Them guys are trouble. So the way... They're a four to six, that's not a good number. So the way we'll do it. It's like this guy, it's almost like that guy doesn't have a purpose here other than an overlapper. <laughs> yeah, I know. You right? know, he doesn't have, really, That's what like, doesn't really have a purpose of it, you know. Because right, he can totally there. go into one of them right. and have a guy give him an overlap. I know. And that drops me down to a two and he's a four. That's not bad. And push me back, then you've got, then you have a four to five on this guy. But you can't get another overlapper here. Otherwise, it'd be great. You can do four to four. And this guy's going like, what the F did I come over here for? No, oh, yeah, well, this guy will go here. And then he's only got that much left to go out to there. That's one. Okay. They're going to wheel enough. Threaten both. Okay. Fair enough. So now they're both in the threat zone. Fair enough. Now, you're wheeling towards him. Okay. So mm -hmm. they're both threatened. Well, you could wheel towards either one of them because they're both. At, they actually. Who had you locked down? Two. Him. Him. Yeah. You're wheeling towards him. Yeah. And then stop there, and it locked him down. So right. that's two. Okay. He's going to back out of the threat zone. Man, is that what I want to do? It'd be a four to six, and I could overlap them and be a four to two. Man, I'm not going to mess around. I'm going to go in. This guy's going in here. Mm -hmm. I think you should still do that. Yeah, but you just he's got to do that. Just get him the F out of the way. And then bring him in here. He's going there. And then overlap him with that solution. He'll overlap. Mm -hmm. So he can come. Uh-huh. Yep. But instead of moving this far back... He's going to kind of come this way then. Okay. He's not going to go so far back. He's going to come shallow or because they're going in. I didn't. Okay. When these guys went in, you had to move them separately, by the way, because they're going to line this way. More. Why would they wheel, hit, and slide? 
because they're closer to, they were closer to lining up with this guy weren't they I'm in only in his threat zone so I, I could wheel you were I could wheel where wheel, were you wheel. Um, Okay, that sounds right. When you wheel, no, you're right. Yeah, you're right. So he would move. My bad. No, my you, my bad. So he's gonna move I'm, over in here. He's this this bigger board, it looked like you were you were more yeah. aligned over here. No. Okay. He's gonna do that. He's gonna do this. Mm -hmm. Yep. One, two, three, four, two left. And you want him perpendicular to him. Yeah. No candy ass angles. That's just going to get you in trouble. Four. You quote, that can be one of my sayings. Candy yeah. ass angles. Six. So this, I could move the light horse. But these, these guys can move as a group, but I don't want to. They I think you should them. just leave them there. Yeah, they're not doing anything. No point in moving them closer it's to me. These guys. It makes my job easier. Move them back, if anything, but I wouldn't do that either. One, two, three, four. I got two left. Two light horse. Or I pay two and screw up. Screw up your. Uh, those guys up. I think that's the thing to do. Screw them up. Pay two to move them. The Saloy? Yeah. And put a thread on this corner. Well, you'll be able to hit them no matter what. But then you're exposed, so you have to. Alright, he's gonna go to here. So I'm threatening you. So you're not threatening me. Correct. And that costs okay. two to do it. We have some combats. Alright, uh, we'll you know go with my first? four to your two. Yep. Come on, big numbers. Nope. Both like candy them. ass. Because I'm a seven to okay. And they both die. It only counts as one killed. Yep. Okay. That drops you down one. Right. So you're a five to four now. Yep. <sighs> you're lucky Eight you get to killed. five. And you're going to come forward. I do. Pips. Six. Okay. I start in the threat zone of an enemy, so it only costs one. Mm hmm For that guy. Yeah, so. Let me see if I want to take somebody with him. Yeah, because he can't move with them, so they'll go with them as well. Okay, yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're moving straight forward, so this is one. Technically, you had to wheel a little bit because remember, I was, that's going to cost you. T oh, it's a thread zone. Never right. mind. Never mind. 
Did I have to wheel a little bit? Well, yeah, you would have to because I was. All right, I'm here. Yeah, just a tip. And you're. I was I was out. I was on this corner. You like that? No. I'll... And so, and you I did not have you threatened, so you had to be past this. Yeah, I was threatening ahead. you, but yeah, so you'd have okay, to wheel. So you're like this. To pull him over, you have to wheel. I mean, I think you yeah, had. It looked like you were wheeled. But if I wanted to move him with him, it'd cost him an extra one. See what I mean? They have to pull him over, you got to. That's a single element. Oh, that's true. Or I could just conform to you. Yeah. What an interesting game. <laughs> no, it's interesting. It's really interesting. I know. It, it's, it, it's I interesting. like it. It looks good. It's so interesting. Far. Yeah, it's interesting. I don't know if it replicates the battle very well. well but what I what I want to do is split the forces. So well, I don't want to pay two. Okay, I yeah. don't want to pay two. So I'm going to come over to you. Okay, and I don't mind having a guy wait a f over here. Okay, so I'm going to come over to you, and then I'm going to. Okay, this <coughs> costs one. Uh -huh. This guy costs one, and that if I'm pulling you over, it ends up cluster effing the rest of this as much as well. Mm -hmm. So the rest of these guys are going to move. Yeah. My front edge, I can't reach you just yet. I don't think. So two. Yeah, I This guy, he can. So what the hell does that mean? What in the hell does that mean? I could wheel with them. But I'm not, you're not in the thread zone, so it costs two to right, do that. It's going to cost me two. So that's one consumed so far. Do I want to? And do I want to do it with the back legions? It can do it. These two guys can do it, but it's going to cost two pips to do it. And it's starting to turn into a cluster. I don't think I need to make contact with it just yet. Sorry. Two. Two. No, I can't reach him. Oh, we have a distance issue. This guy would be double. Yeah, right now he's the only double. That's all one. If he goes any. And gets him out of the way here. Because he doesn't need to be there. You just got the call. Those guys lost at this point. Okay, so this is um, one, two, three, and if I got three for this. 
so. Well, that cost two. No, I moved within range. No, that guy. Why? Because he was out. Everybody. No, had... no, I moved. I moved over here. I just checked it. Yeah. Oh, he was. Oh, yeah. like going backwards. Correct. Was Correct. Yeah, you know, he was. He was out definitely <clears throat> before. Oh, gotcha. And he can't make. He can't do that just yet. Five to four. Get him! Look at this. Got him! Man, I got you 20. Well, so far, it's playing okay. So far, so good. So and far, it's And you've been rolling really good pips. I was kind of hoping. Yes, that, but I roll really bad combat. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, it's, it's, it's part of pips, it. pips, I was kind of hoping you'd have a pip problem, but it's not. Six? No, Six I don't have a pip two. problem at all. I have fleet. Well, he flees like a mother. Uh, one six, one six. Yeah. And I'm not going to advance. Nope. So his range will be there. Yep. Okay. You're up. That's why I moved him out of there. Oh, bastard. <laughs> You're teabagging all the bodies. <laughs> yeah. Well, I want to keep you. Mm -hmm. I think you have to do that. I'm not going to go into combat, but I'm going to... Ever so slightly this shy. That's what a coward would do. Keep you from telling them what to do. No combats? No combats. Give me a big number. It's big enough. This is important. It's easier to do two fours. The only guy that won't check this guy. He's the only guy that costs one to go straight forward. Otherwise, everything costs two. And you only get a four. I can get two kills by throwing that in. Him and then these guys on the side. Shit. God, it's a tough call. Or do I push in and then close? Which is, you know, the whole purpose of this journey is to go down there. The whole purpose of the journey. I'll be a six down to a five, and you'll be a five down to a four, and I'll get one kill. Here it's two to two, and I'll get two kills. I don't think you can do a wheel into that. I don't think I can do both. You have to take the one. question is which guy do I want to do? <clears throat> want to do the guy that's farther away from the action. Two, two. Get him! Get him. Got him. Ah, nice. That I was hoping to Dead Namidian! Dead Namidian! That one hurt last Roll that one, so that hurts was, again. I was going to move them to do something. Mm -hmm. I was going to bring them back. Well, you're too busy raping my guys. No, I here. was going to... Roll it one, see if you're still They were done. There was time to pull out. Nope. Raping's done. <laughs> Let's see. This is what you call a yin yang. Well, I think you need two kills. You do? No, you do. And I do. Yeah, we both need two kills.
Okay, so he's got these two guys. Mm -hmm. I agree with you. They're both threatened. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I think I'm going to spend two. One thing's for sure, don't put them in the camp. <laughs> it's not going to do you any good. You put them in the camp, and I take the camp, and that's two kills. Yeah. You know? Oops. He doesn't fight any better than it. So that's two. Okay. You're lucky he's over here. Mm-hmm. Because otherwise, well, I had to put somebody over there to cover the flank. I didn't want to put the Saloy where your two cattle will just munch on them. Yeah. So, I guess I could have unpacked the legions, but F that. It's not what they would have done. Here Three. We go. This bear is better grow a pair. <laughs> you better hurry up and grow a pair. I think it's a good scenario. Yes. I don't know that it represents the battle okay, but it doesn't matter. You, you can't no, it, I think it's, it works good. Uh, no combat. No combat. Here we go. This is, this is big. Roll one. Right now. Should be just him. Sounds about right. And yep. I won't be spending I won't be spending it on him. I won't be spending it on him. Well here's the thing. Here's the thing. I can't move this group because it costs three. I can't wheel them. Right. Wait. No, this guy you can't. Time out. This guy. Start some threats on enemy. He's not, you're not, downwind. nobody's threatening him. If this element or at least one element of group contacts an enemy element with its front edge. He's not being threatened and nobody's in his threat zone. So he can't wield. He could fade two pips and go straight forward. I can move two pips and move straight forward. I moved them too far. I can't close. Oh, well, these guys would have made the same mistakes. That's what got him into this predicament. <laughs> I should just move both of these guys into combat, and if they get encircled and trapped, well, there you go. There's the massacre. <laughs> you know? This guy costs three to move. This guy costs one. One. Two if he wheels. Two if he wheels. This would cost two. Two. But they have to go straight. And these guys can't go with them. This group can't go with them. It's got to be only this group of two, this group of four, eight, or th with this group of eight. So I'm going to do this, and I'm going to come over to you. Just don't really have a choice. Now we'll be able to next time. If there is a next time. If there is. Yeah, and you got to close the door when you get a chance to. You just have to. <clears throat> uh, five to five. It is. Look, and they're candy asses. Oh my gosh. And they, they, almost, you. they almost died. And I go back 15. See if this is, is critical. It, wait, it's a double though. Hmm? No, it's a double base. No, this oh, is, you'll, this you'll is one back. unit. No, but. Oh, yeah. You gotta go back and you're hit that group. right. I'm gonna go back 20. I'm yeah. gonna recall 20. Yeah. 
don't know if we did that right over there. Did I recoil? Well, these were quick kills here. No, yeah, okay, you didn't. And I doubled you on the other. I doubled you here and I quick killed you there. Okay, so roll a one. You can't do shit no. over there. It's not, <laughs> that's not what I want to do. <laughs> Three! Well, this was the deal. Yeah, you got to do that. Now you got one left over. It's up to the, this Vera's candy ass. So it's a three to two. Get him some. Nope. Got That's him. That's it. Game over. That's what I was, when you when you segregated him like screw that. I'll just kill him. Well, there's nothing I could do if I had him over there covering. Yeah. And and he was fine where he was, but yeah. that one legion just completely popped. Uh huh. And the other one's like. Okay, I mean, I even moved them back. I don't know what else I could have done other than yeah. not have that one legion die. And it was the one that was fighting Hannibal. Yeah. You know? Yep. Well, that's so that was my idea is to make you split. Put well, yeah, two you gotta split. Yeah. You gotta so split and get. His, historically, well, historically, you don't have enough troops. Yeah. You have to have more because there weren't really any gaps. You know, but they had a solid line. They, they had a in, solid. They they, the they had a solid mountain. line here, and and they just gave up. They you know they had a special rule like they always roll fours or something like that when they go into combat, mm -hmm. so they wouldn't die, but they kept getting pushed back. Uh -huh. And and then the sides went, and it uh -huh. was just you know it was over. Once the once the cavalry get behind them, they're they're up a creek. Yeah. You know, and they should be deep like this, so that it's like, oh, you hit me from behind. Okay, I turned to face. Oh, shit, I got nowhere to go? Then they pick up, you know, mm -hmm. kind of thing. Yeah. No, that but, makes... I like the way... Hey, I at like least this, Hannibal won. I like this series. Of course, he never made it over the Alps. Oops. Actually, <laughs> he did. He just had yeah. to recruit another army. Yeah. Yep. But, uh... I like this series. This is cool. Um, I don't think in this scenario I want to be you. I would just have a lot of tough decisions to make. Yeah, it's, there's it's, a lot of pressure. You can't just, like for me, these guys got their ass kicked, and the Romans. So it's like, oh, push forward. Well, and if I die, I at least feel good about it. But you know, like I said, I, I had to get you the split because otherwise you have to. Yeah, yeah. you can't just set up the solid. Well, you have to hit me on the flanks. Like, yeah, but you got to split the infantry too, so you have to make a choice. You know, so you got to like, and you did. You broke off. And I had enough groups to deal with well, whoever. Well, these guys couldn't be here, right? Or they would have, they would have right. died earlier. Well, I thought I was never going to engage over here. The light horse. I just that time I rolled the pip, the one. If I rolled a three or more, they were going to double. I was going to bring them back around this way. I was right, that disengage. didn't work. I was going to disengage. Well, I was like, if I'm going to lose four elements, let it be four of these. Yeah. Four eight blades. Yeah. But I put somebody over there. Yeah. You know, if I had another cav, this army has only one cav. I had but another cav, good. Good he would have been over there. I would have put the general in the center location. But another cav would be too much. Either if you give the Romans our cav, then you got to give the, these guys more troops. I think I, I would have given those guys more troops. Yeah. So, and there's also word on the street. So these guys are supposed to be Spanish. There's word on the street that these guys would be rep better represented by fast blades. Mm-hmm. That the Spanish would be better represented by fast blades because uh -huh. the problem is solid auxilia just they can't hold up they can't blade. hold up against blade not and blade. not plus one blade. Yeah. Anyways, I think it's okay. I mean, I think I think, so. I think all four scenarios are, are just fine. I like I like the extra pips that they're trying to do anything they can't. It's just difficult. So and you know, the like, first one casualties didn't matter. Yeah. Right. Yep. The second one. Was kind of a standard battle, but I had guys that were hung out to dry. Uh -huh. That's cool too. The third one, uh, I'm ambushed, but yep. it can go all kinds of different ways. Yeah. And then this is kind of a standard battle, but think, kind of not. I, I, I like all four. I of think them. you could play these series over and over, and they come out different every time. Like, they could. I mean, you got to be careful with this battle at the Carthaginians. You, you got to be careful. I mean, the longer they stay unengaged with the blades. Well, I had great pip rolls in this yes. battle. Terrible combat rolls. Yes. Terrible. Yeah. yeah. It happens. That's, that's every, why we play guys games with dice. So. Every time I think would be different, but very cool. Very, very fun to play. I, I think the coolest one is the first one. Mm -hmm. I like that one. Because a lot. it's quaint. Yeah. You know, it's it's I don't have 
that many guys. Uh -huh. And I enjoyed playing that one a lot. Yeah. And it was simple. Just stop them. And it was and, simple for you. Get these two guys off. And the Carthaginians can't sit around in that one either. They got to get deployed. They got to go. Because even though they kill people, they're coming back. Coming back. So you can't wait around. Sooner yeah. or later, you lose the attrition war. So you got to you got to keep pushing. Yep. Well, there you have it, folks. Did you have a good time? I did. I like that series. Yeah. That was a cool series. Yeah, I agree. Okay, well, don't forget to like and subscribe and check out our other programming that we have and uh, more to come. Sounds good. See you, folks. See ya.